<clears throat> Ahoy there, mates. Silver Pyre here today, and today we are playing Dungeons and Dragons. Verona, make what you will. Our, D our DM from all the way from the West Coast will. Yo. Yo, yo, I, what's up? I was, tempt I was actually tempted to make a wizard to the West Coast joke, but oh well, too late now. Yo, yo, what's up? <laughs> uh, <laughs> also here is K, Rue, uh, Rue, and the Fifth Wall. What's that? So, what's that? Are you quite finished? Okay, we, we can't start doing that. Oh my god, my ears. <laughs> uh, I think Sorry. I feel my ears actually bleeding on my end. <laughs> that sounds a good mute. That was a good joke, though. Yeah, it's a it's an oldie Ooh. but a goodie, like a really mm -hmm. old one. So I'm gonna send some messages real quick, and then I'll switch it over to the live screen. All right. Sending messages. Ooh. Yeah, I'm trying to promote the channel a little bit. <laughs> Uh. Yeah. All right. So, DM, please take us away. <laughs> All right. Hold on. I'm trying to. I'm trying to set my seat. <sighs> God, it's hot in here. <sighs> anyway. <laughs> anyway. Last time on Verona. <laughs> Damn, that was a rude interruption. <laughs> <laughs> this burp midway. <laughs> anyway, last time on Verona, make what you will. Our party fucked up majorly. On with the storm. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that is <laughs> not <laughs> very specific. Anyway, anyway they anyway they uh, anyway they woke up a very pissed off tor turtle. Uh, destroyed a good section of the map. Well, considering that and there was a... A, now there's a giant, and now there's a giant. Now, considering still... that there was a town right around this area, yeah, we fucked no, up pretty no. badly. It's where lions are. Sweet. Well, the lions are dead. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Lions. Yeah, Wonder <laughs> is just <laughs> on his. Good callback. That was a good throwback. I'll yeah, admit that that is a pretty good callback. I uh, wonder is just pancakes or lions of the deep. Of the wonder underdeep. is just on his knees. He's just slamming on the ground repeatedly, saying, "I broke my code. I broke my code. I broke my code. I broke my code." <laughs> okay, what the hell is this code? Because, damn. Well, he has a code of honor, and technically one of his codes is that he'll never harm an innocent. <laughs> and what that's exactly that? what he did. He <laughs> harmed many innocents in the <laughs> last episode. Basically, it was an accident. Yeah. This Still. is going to go up, tap him on and the shoulder, I'm say, I'm no sure good. did so. Can I have your sword? <laughs> Wonder takes wow. his sword. No, I call dibs. It's mine. Wonder <laughs> takes off his uh, sword. Grabs I call wolf. dibs. It's mine. No, I don't know. Hold on. Takes Wait, he doesn't. Even, he doesn't even need. Hold on. Yeah, I call dibs. May I do my thing? Yeah. All right. So Wonder has this, his katana in both of his hands. In both of his hands, he just opens it up and it says, "Safe place." As you see, his katana turned to uh, cherry blossoms and car gets carried onto the wind. Well, that wasn't very. I've at least fuck. Given wow. it, to me. I've been working on that. <laughs> I would not have realized that that was a thing you could do. Yeah, I for probably for I forgot to mention that he could do that whenever. Okay, why though? 
Just in case if he wanted to retire. So what happened to or the Or if something like this happened? Or something like this happened, yeah. Okay, what happened to the sword, though? Wonder's not gonna tell you. Yeah. So we just we turned into cherry blossoms and flown over. Wonder goes. I feel. Wonder attacked. just ties and. Uh, turns I was friends with that sword, and now I feel attacked. I'm. Yeah. He goes. I have a I'm sorry. Do make... I? Do I know you? He looks at all of you. With this weird, like, do I know you? Wander? Well, he broke, so let's move on. Wander, if I, you don't start making sense, I'm gonna bitch slap. <laughs> he how, broke. How do you know my name? I have never seen any of you in my entire life. Well, he broke. <laughs> Wander. His name isn't Wander, by the way. I am he with your mother. It, it's a, it's kind of his nickname type of thing. That long run have a kind of a nickname system. Yeah. Wonder, I have oh, a tea with your mother every Tuesday. Don't give me this shit. What, what are you talking about? The ghost of your mother. I have tea with her every Tuesday. <laughs> Wait, what? Yeah. <laughs> I'm making up. She's great with conversation. Right. She's a great combo. I feel like I've done here. something terrible. We should probably go to the nearest yeah, teleporter. Not. And I'm going to turn you... myself in. How about you don't? They don't necessarily... <laughs> and you don't remember anything. Oh, oh by the way, um, Silver, take, take a look at the bottom. Yeah, I see him. What yeah, happened? you're welcome. Happened. Anyways. You're welcome, by the way. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Maybe you could just stop. Maybe you can just get a makeover. Wonder says, again, I thank you for the offer, but I feel like I've committed a lot of murder just recently. You didn't trust me. All hey, he points over to the city that is scorched. That was the hey, turtle. Did that. Good job, bud. What turtle? You blame really? the turtle. You can't take the blame for a fucking turtle. Blame the turtle. He goes, what <laughs> turtle? turtle? You don't take the blame for that. It's the goddamn the turtle. turtle. Sword, and you did that all by yourself. Yeah, you did that. Total. Actually, he very much could do that by himself with the sword. Well, regardless, I, I feel it as if I'm responsible. Bitch, don't come at me with that shit. I will bitch slap you across the goddamn thing. I'm not putting up with this shit. Just, just, just kind of looked up to, to wander. Hello. Jake steps up to wander and uh, holds his hand out to like help you up on your feet. I'm here, fella. Again, like I said, I've you never were seen any in my life. entire I, life. I, I don't know. <laughs> hey, Siv. You guys yeah. can roll insight on him. Hey, Siv. Try slapping yeah. him across the face. With advantage. Uh, uh, advantage? Well, yeah, I mean, he doesn't have the cool sword anymore, so I think Mist is quickly losing interest. <laughs> Medicine. <laughs> Do it again because you had advantage. Oh, okay. I'm gonna put on an advantage. Nat twenty. Yep. All uh, right, you bitch. You base. You pimp slap him across the face. All of a sudden, he gains all his memories back. Oh damn! Oh fuck. Yeah, and his eyes are back yeah. as his eyes are now widened. And he falls on his knees again. <laughs> you bitch slapped him so hard that he regained memory. Alright, can we move past the whole I murdered a city thing and just leave already? Yeah. <laughs> no missed speaking out loud. Yeah, I'm just going to like... Uh, Wander uh, uh, gets uh, up and walks towards the nearest town.
Well, that would be the one you scorched. The one with the nearest teleporter, of course. That's the one you scorched. No, it's right here. This one. Oh, okay, yeah. Uh, and I'm just going to follow him. You follow him. He's kind of done. Remember? He's yeah. Gonna follow yeah, I'm going to keep the like, cool weapons I'm now. right up next to him. Like, what my the fuck? priorities. <laughs> he doesn't say a word. Don't just walk off while I'm talking to you. He does not say I'll a word. Up. I'll be shut the memory out of you. Motherfucker. Man, out of you. Sif. Do me a favor. I slapped the man out of him. Labor. The face. Release my mother. She at least deserves that much. I don't know how. I slapped the man out of him. How about you try slapping your scythe? That seemed to work on me. <laughs> I didn't slap him with my side. I slapped him with my hand. And that, no, but he suggested you slap you your hand onto the scythe and see what happens. What? I think I would just cut myself. Oh, no, that is a good it. point. Try it. Slap That's the scythe. That's a magic weapon. Slap your scythe. With advantage. Ooh, she's been good to me. She's my friend. And she's slap not being with advantage. a jackass. Right? Do it. These are the last words. Here we go. I, I got you. I'll do it. No. Do it like oh, the twinkle fairy you're... that you are. <laughs> Wander, I swear is, to God. Is Rain unvanished vanished yet? Yes, he's unvanished. And K, do <laughs> it. It's his final words. Just do it. Okay, do am, it. I am I rolling something? Medicine. <laughs> you're slapping your side. Yep, he release, release his mother. Oh, Use yeah. medi the medicine skill from now on. You slap things. <laughs> yeah, yeah, perfect. Hey, <laughs> uh, wake up! Okay, Wonder, I swear to God, I was slapped the amnesia back in. I mean, in one of in one of my campaigns, we uh, one of our, the players did uh... by kicking animals. <laughs> okay, okay, so. Where's the teleporter in this town? It's in the center. I mean, you're not leaving without. Great. But there is be. He's going to be the new king of the necromancy kingdom. He has some things he can do in that situation. Yeah, Wonder <laughs> just goes to the center of town to the teleporter thing. And just wants to go over here because he wants to turn himself in. And so, yeah, I'm, also a noble. I'm a noble there in a print. Over here. Over here. Yeah. Okay. You do now that the, do see, all now the, the bad really you in follow. this situation. Do the rest yeah. of you follow. Yeah. Uh, uh, cool ass sword is gone. I've lost interest in him. But I'm trying to choose my new target. Should it be the magic scythe or the guns? Go for both. <laughs> nah, Go for both. I will steal your. What will the magic scythe do? Steal your soul. <laughs> he doesn't like uh... you. He only likes those of the of Death Moon Bloodline. Uh, yeah. Wonder yeah, did... yeah, but it, it yeah, it's it, but it'll steal half a soul because it's technically half a soul. Yeah. Wonder just goes up to the nearest guard and says, please do arrest me. I apologize for the destruction of your fair city. Uh, don't, don't mind him. He, he's being um, stupid. Okay. Not, he, he did. Um, alright. I, I don't know if this is the right I thing guess. to roll. Hmm? You're under arrest, I guess? <laughs> Slaps manacles on you, drag if you to you it. If you don't believe me, ask the wizard who protects your town. Yeah, no, nah, no, nah, man. He's just strong. He thought he did this. He's really drunk, as you can tell. What um, I just got the confirmation. Yeah, it's yeah, it's this guy. So, yeah, um, you coming with me? I guess. Yes. Honestly, I was not expecting this, but whatever. 
<laughs> I broke my code. Therefore, I have okay. to pay the price. I, I, I did not need the exposition, dude. No, he's, he's telling to the guard, I broke the code, and now I pay the price. I, I give him, like, dude, five I, Dude, I do not care for the exposition. I give him, like, five gold. For, just, just, for all just, I care, you feel bad about what something that happened, and that's all I really care, okay? This is just gonna hand him five gold and just, like, forget about this. I think it's gonna take more than five gold to repair all the fire plants that was around the city. I yeah, think that would require persuasion. <laughs> no. That does a 27 word. No. Okay, okay. Uh, uh, Dude, uh, just for that. A little, we already went through little the little trouble of making a new, a new character to replace Wander. So, fuck it's so Wander. Wander. He's my, he's the best anymore, man at my wedding. Alright, so... Uh, hey, Wander, yeah, I guess you don't take your money anymore, do you? I, if he, he's not going to take it. I'm, he's not. If it's not going to work, then I'm taking my money. Wander gives uh, the gold to uh, the charity, like all of it. Just all the charity, like all of the charity. <laughs> Every single bit of charity. All right. So, the, what does the guard do? And charity goes back to the hooker bar. Right? He just takes you. To, he just takes you. Yeah. Does anyone follow Wander? Technically. Yeah. How the yeah. hell would I follow Wander? No, they just take you. No, they just take him to the. They just take him to the dungeon. And then you just kind of see, and you just, then you just kind of see him, like right down on the scroll, all throw it up in the air, and it just kind of burns. Was that a ma was that a magic scroll that sends a ma Yeah, pretty much. Uh, who is he? Who are you sending it to? Yeah, hold on. I sh guy? you shall see here in a second. I just I just gotta do a bit of reading real quick. All right. I should okay. Sure you have to I should be able to use that an hour to fix this. Okay, about ten minutes later, you see a six foot three. You see a six foot three human with red hair, hair, and some really good facial hair, I must add. Uh, wearing wearing a high ranking guards outfit. How much are those worth? And and some armor and some and some really nice armor with a very fancy looking shield, shield and a very and a very polished sword. This guy already. And who may you be? And he's like, ah, oh, there. Oh, oh, hey. Uh, yeah, there you are, Dan. Um, so yeah, this is apparently the guy responsible for the destruction outside. Is Bitch, he now? you lied to the giant fucking turtle oh, no. outside that the voice you chose for him. No. <laughs> I'm still trying to come up with a voice for him. Is he now? Right. Yeah. Apparently. Turned himself in. That's apparently some kind of code of honor. I don't give a shit. I don't, I honestly don't give a shit. Uh, wait, I recognize this. This long run. Is he the one that caused that crater at the front gate? Oh shit! Yeah. Now that you mention it, yeah. Totally did that. Shit, you're responsible for a lot of... Honestly, I'm more than glad that you're in here now. You do not yeah. have to worry about me nor my katana anymore. Turned his sword to petals. It was... What did he even do with that anyway? It just turned into petals and, and just drifted off. What, what, what <laughs> I like how Wander pretty much became Captain Weave. Wander says it's in safe place. Al, can you point me in the like, right even direction? Even I kind of worked that. for that. Thing. Even if you, can if you... I did tell you the cave judged you, it shows your true intentions. In other words, you, Mist, would never ever get your hands on that sword. Okay. <laughs> Damn. I'm confused. Laying it, dick. 
So it, it just like move on to a fucking grim Wait. dude? Wait, does anyone in the party currently have a chin? Have a what? Does it, does anyone in the party actually have a chance at getting the sword? Uh, uh, what do you need for a chance? Uh, Jake is lawful good. Jake might right. have a chance. Rain might have a chance. And Hawk might have a chance, but Wonder is not going to disclose where the location is. Wait, Jake? Rain is lawful good oh, and Mist is lawful right. good. Yeah. Hawk evil. Yeah, yeah out, of, out of those three, yeah, they seem the most likely. Well, uh, well mine uh, is Hawk. Other well, than Hawk. Dan. Yeah, so Hawk. yeah, out of everyone right now, I think Dan... I think Dan, Jeg, Rain, and possibly Sith would have a chance. Oh, Rain doesn't really have it. Had experience with uh, uh, sentient weapons, as you can see. Wonder says... No, it's because, even it's because I, you had a good heart. Yeah. Wonder says, even if I did tell you, I don't remember that part. That's the part that keeps it locked away. I know where mm. around it is. I'm not going to tell you where it is. Can't even tell your old, you can't even tell your good closest friend. You can't even tell hey, your closest friend, friend miss. Yeah, it is part. it is somewhere on this plane. That's all I am disclosing. That helps. Freaking jackass. It's Can somewhere I on this Dan? continent if yeah. that helps. Dan Dan is just like completely confused of all this. Uh, Dan, knowing knowing the kind of destruction that that sword can bring, and you just um you kind of scramble for some guards for some guards to just try to find it so that way they can procure uh, procure it and uh, keep it in a safe spot. Yeah, hey, it's already wonder. in a safe spot. A wonder. But yeah, I've been here this the whole time. I completely forgot to roleplay him. Hey, Com wander. Comforting Wander while Rain mocks Wander. Hey, Wander, right. where did you train? Oh, yeah, real quick. Uh, do the yeah, RP uh, roleplay initiative. Yep. Hold on. No, 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 do you want me to do Wander? But... Oh, uh, yeah, sure. Uh, give me a second. I'll have to pull it up. Wait, I forgot to click. Oh wait, I can't click my. Uh... Hold on, is that the? I think that's the blind pal. Uh, the twenty one. Uh, I'll just reroll it. Uh, I can't click on uh, Dan. Really? Yeah, I'm clicking on him, and it's just. Oh wait, no. Oh wait. Uh, try putting his token in. Hold on. Now I can. Yeah, it was because I, I placed it. Mm. All right. And I'll just roll straight up for Wander, but he's not going to be <laughs> in it for very long. Oh, Wander goes first. You get the stage. Uh, Wander says, quite simply, oh, as he's okay. being put away, the sword is somewhere where I used to train. Does anybody know where that is? I feel like Sif no. would know. He's spent the most time with him. Uh, roll a history check. Sweet. I have proficiency in that. Uh, advantage or just normal? Normal. Yes. All right. The 17. DM, what do you know? He would know. All right, so everyone but Sif, uh, deafen yourselves real quick. 
except the DM. Of course. I can hear nothing. All right. So you remember Wander's home back in session one slash two, where Wander visited the grave? The grave. Yeah, I can't remember. I just never yeah, seen it. Yeah, it's around map. that area. Where on the map was that? Uh, over here. Ah. Uh, okay. Got it. Oh, wait. That, oh, wait. They might have seen that. The pain. Oh, uh, shit. The pain. Eh. They just can't act on it. Just tell them. Yeah, yeah, they can't act on it. All right, but uh, that's only if they can put two together. But that's only if they put two and two together. Uh -huh. Yeah. Well, let me just do this to. Con All right, so I'm gonna say, uh, I'm gonna say to both of them, stick. You're clear. They're, for that, the both of them are clear. Right. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm gonna miss those. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, well, they didn't, uh, didn't undeath themselves yet. I did. Uh, all right. Mm -hmm. Is it safe to return? Yes, it's safe to yep. return. Woo. You wonder. Know, I wonder. I'm gonna miss those teeth. I'm sorry, what? Oh uh, yeah, every Tuesday, me and your mom just ha sat down to have a cup of tea. <laughs> if I was an honorable man, I would punch you in your gut. What we, all we did was talk. You'd also have to reach him through yeah, the bars. He's fun to talk to. I mean, push him up you? against the bars. I didn't do anything. He just gives you the. I look like sure. I think it would be funny if he punches my you. Best friend, I wouldn't do. All right, whatever you say. I'm pretty sure at this point he's your only friend. Yeah, pretty much. Which is why I don't want him to go. I mean, hey, you just have to make. Unless I pulled, you know, fucking. Ground Prince bullshit, which I'm definitely going. I don't think I can actually do anything. It's a lot of political sway I can do. Besides, I'm sure we could figure something out to fix all the land. Dan goes, what about the whole book of light? Isn't it supposed to be rumored to fix the land or whatever? Wonder you got your, your way to fix this. I shall stay here so until just... it. My damage is undone. Dude, I can just revive anyone that died. Yeah, well, I'll try walking yeah. outside the city. See That's how, not how you necromancers left. work. I can just revive okay. everybody who died. Yeah, I'm walking out the My little skeleton. Two steps outside of the city, though. Yeah, try taking a few go, steps out of the city and then tell me you can revive them. I will go buy a goddamn rope and get out of the city and revive them. How are you going to repair the land? Uh, so you can't revive them, you can only turn them into mindless skeletons. Nah, or, or zombies. Plus they'll gain their sadians back after like 24 hours. You know, they'll be back to being all self. Just won't you know, gain uh, sentience, they become monsters. Yeah. Hours. For like 24 hours. Don't you remember? Is that a. Wait, is that Fred? That was a there. That was a joke, Fred, number one. Number two. Chance, and it's a new sentience. It's not a, the same guy he was when he was alive. If anything, you're making it impossible to reincarnate them because they'll be undead. Oh. 
Okay. We're talking about undeath and shit that one time. Uh, you can't deathless. reincarnate someone who's currently undead, even with true reincarnation. How does that even work in D and D? What? I'm I'm not even sure. Does what work? Uh, oh, um, uh, resurrection does not work. True resurrection. Yeah, resurrection. Ninth level spell. True resurrection doesn't work Can in this world. Can't bring them back, but that is a ninth level spell. Yeah. Resurrection, true resurrection, or resurrection does not work, but reincarnation does. Wait, why doesn't true resurrection not work? That's the way the afterlife works in this in this setting. How does it okay. Work? Explain that to me. How does it work? I have explained it to you guys multiple times. Yeah. Mm. Basically, mm. once we die, we're we're done. Yeah, pretty much. Oh, damn. There are like several afterlives, but yeah, it's kind of yeah. All right. So, <laughs> wonders behind bars, just what? patiently waiting now. Dick wants to know what happened to Wonder's mom. It's like, by the way, Mike. Um, by the way, Silver, I'm currently making the chart. Yep. All right. So blind paladins go be uh, talking to the person that uh, Wonder turned turn himself turn in, over, but... uh, turn himself into, and he goes, "Excuse me." Mm-hmm. Yeah. What what exactly did he do? Apparently all the shit that's outside. Right. And people call He didn't him. do that. That was a turtle. Yeah, the one so that, that was him. not his fault. Well, technically Wander did pick up the book that released the turtle. Technically, you didn't know it was a something. You didn't know it would happen. So technically, I didn't, didn't say he didn't. Andrew, but... you don't have to lock yourself in there. I'm like this is your fault at all. Something. Do... But he's playing he's himself. Impossible. That's he's just probably and... going through grief. Oh yeah, Wonder is still worthy, by the way, DM. Is what? Wonder is still worthy of the sword. Uh. Oh, I'll keep that note. I could get it back to him. Yeah. Let, let Wander do his blind paladin thing. And then well, we'll technically he's not worthy because he doesn't believe he's worthy. Therefore, he's not. Well, him believing in him and the sword choosing him are two different things. Plus, I would, I would slap that belief back. You know how I like I slapped his back. I'm slapping right back in. And Wonder's mind, slap he's back a back. murderer. And he should also oh, he didn't. So technically, no, he's not. No, he's, he's totally a murderer. It's definitely his fault. Be... Also, did we ever level up? I don't think we did. Ah. I mean, all we did was effectively poke it with a stick. So. <laughs> yeah. All we yeah. did was just poke the dragon turtle. Oh, yeah. It's it's a stick. We didn't actually do anything to the turtle. It kind of just woke I mean, we up. unsealed it, then resealed Anyways, it. But... <laughs> uh, Blind Paladins goes, I need to see if my contact is within the town. I shall be back shortly. Do all the innocent village, villagers count as XP totals? I don't. <laughs> I think they're going to That's fucked up, and no. Uh, okay. Take that XP. Uh, DM, question? Can yeah. my paladin find one of the uh, sites? One turn order. The sites? Yeah, the secret sites. Can he find one of them in the town? He wants to talk to one of them. Uh, sure. What? Sure. Um, spe well, specifically, you can only really con you're only allowed to talk to the your master sort of thing. Anyway, um, anyway, uh, others. Who else? Oh, yeah, it's currently BP. Yeah, but... yeah that's why I'm saying the BP is looking for that. Yeah, all right. Well, all right. Well, um, so yeah, 
All right, go and do that. You know how to contact him. He will respond, and he will respond accordingly. Uh, you will get to talk to him within two days. All right. So, Jeg, what do you do? Jeg is just going to go ahead, step up to Wander's cell, kind of holding the brim of his hat. This goes, well, well, I ain't known you for real, wrong, for real long, but I know a determined man when I see If you think you belong here, I ain't going to argue it, whether I believe it or not. So wherever your journeys take you, hope you live long and well. And Jake just tips his hat and goes ahead and wanders out the dungeon. All right. Hmm. So you said this new guy has a lot of fancy clothes on, correct? Uh, more like yeah, fancy kind of. armor. That too. Your, does he look like he makes a lot of money? Yes. Actually, what is mm-hmm. my gold count currently for uh, Dan? Roll me D500. Okay. By the way, your gold income is. Uh, by the way, your. By the way, your gold income is five hundred gold per month. Jesus, that's a lot of gold. That's how much you get I paid. Had... That's oh, how man. much you get paid at your as a. Yeah, that's how much you get paid. As what a royal guard? Well, no, that's what my character gets paid. No, he's a captain. Well, he's a technically he's a captain. second captain. So like so, second in well, there's, well the no, there's gonna be like ranks like military. So like there's like uh, there's privates, there's corporals, oh like there's private. So it goes like uh, privates. Uh, there's a uh, there's privates or rookies, is sergeants, captains, lieutenants, and and then head and then head. So. So, like, he's lieutenant of the Royal Guard? Or something. Like, oh, I'm the captain. Like, he's, fa- he's fairly high rank. Uh-huh. He- he's a he's a captain. Right. Yeah, the rank yeah the go the ranks go as rookie, sergeant, captain, lieutenant, and then head of the guard. Oh, so he's. Ca- so yeah, he's a he's a captain. So he's like he's kind of he's kind of midway. To- he's uh-huh. fairly high rank. Mm. Captains, lieutenant, yeah, captains, lieutenant, uh, captains and lieutenants, uh, and the and the head get like special, uh, ske- special magic items unique to them. Is it worth it? Is it worth as, as, a, as, a, as a symbol of their as a symbol of their rank? Mm. And worth currently, Robin. he's a captain. All right. Um, his like the like the like the magic item he got to symbolize his rank is a shield. He's currently wearing that shield, I believe. Yes, it's on his back currently. This mm-hmm. doesn't use shields. I think I'm more interested in the guns. I'm going to follow Jag. <laughs> oh, by the way, um, Silver, roll me a D8. Okay. I will send you a private message of the result. Is it for Wander? Oh, no, yeah. it's... Uh... Something. Don't yeah. Don't say. Don't ruin it yet. Something interesting. Seven. Was it like a wild? What the shield does? Nope. You guys will see later. Interesting. Mist is going to try and convince Jag to teach him how to shoot a gun. Because he just watched. You right, I, sent you the re- I sent you the results of the roll in the private message. Right. Who is it? Sif's turn now? Oh. It w- no, it's Jeg. I haven't received it yet. Yeah. Yeah, it's currently Jeg's turn for the roleplay stage. I thought he did that already. Well, uh, think- yeah, Jeg's uh, done. Oh, wait, yeah, he did do it already, didn't he? Yeah, yeah then go yeah, ahead, man. I'm just talking to Jeg right now. 
Just is just about to go and try and convince Jag to okay, then teach him how to shoot a gun. Uh, all right, well, uh, Mist, give Jag an argument, and then Jag decide whether or not his argument is good enough. I saw you successfully pierce the turtle shell with one of those things. Those How exactly things. do those oh, work? Dude. Oh, these things? Oh, they ain't nothing. And he goes and pulls out his revolver and just kind of chats by it for a second. Just re- really excited and happy about them for some reason. It's like, ain't nah, nothing? this is just a little six shooter. It don't do too much. If it weren't for, you know, me how to it. it. Well, sure, that ain't no problem. I ain't going to do it in the city, though. You know, the city Fair folk enough. don't like all that gun toting and whatnot. As soon as we head out of town, I wouldn't mind giving you a few practice shots. All right. Uh, since he's done here, hmm. I'll wander the town looking for anything he can. All right, well, what's Sib do? All right, Sib. This is, um,. I know you believe you're at fault, but I, I don't, and I think I have a way to prove it. And in the meantime, are uh, you gonna you, stay him, put? Your company. In the meantime, stay put. In the no, me. In the meantime, you can have this guy for company. I just kind of just summon a scout. Oh, that's kind. Yeah. Even though that skeleton's gonna get killed as soon as it's spotted. Yeah, Wonder's not paying attention to you, nor to Skeleton. He's currently meditating. Yeah. You know, I'll just put this as a no. You can give him a, you can give him a reanimated skull. A what? A reanimated skull. What is um, basically, it, it'll it, it'll basically be a necromancer telephone. Oh, sure. I'll do. Did, did I do something for that? Uh, uh nah, nah, just just uh, we'll just say the animate dead spell does that. Okay. Uh, I'm like a random skull right. that just so happens to be in my cell. For a wonder. Yeah. Yeah, it'll essentially be a skeleton magical telephone. Telepathic. And it'll be like a more telepathic thing on uh, Sips and. Right. Like, how, what's, what's the range on that? Um, as far as, as far as needed. Right. Okay. I have to go now. But I'll be. And I, uh, I go out to. Look for supplies for mountain climbing. All right, rain. All right. Um, I go up to wander, meditating right now, and I also know you can probably hear me. No, this is not your fault at all, and I know you blame yourself, but none of us knew that that would happen. But we would have made the same mistake picking up that book. So, when you're ready to come out, just come on out. I know you have the ability to escape. I'm sure Sif would have done that. Uh, you see yourself escape. like this. Other than that, I'm not going to try and force you to do anything. Uh, hopefully. And Rain will head out. It is now Zola's turn. What? 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 It's Zola's it is turn. Zola. I know it's Zola's turn. What, what is the DM doing? I don't know. Yeah. Out of curiosity, does anyone realize there's a Missing cog from this little machine group of ours. No, I think I realized that Zola's back in the ocean city. I'm but back. We haven't... 
Oh yeah, Zola's all the way in the ocean currently. Yeah, he's still in the teleportation circle. So I'm fully uh, can aware. We, of can we rule that he somehow took the teleporter to, to the city? To the city. Oh that wait, yeah, in? that's right. You guys are still technically tritons. Yeah, no, that, that's what Rain will do. He'll go retrieve Zola after the whole thing. That's yeah, the, please yeah, do. Hello, hello. He, he remembers that we have another party member. Guys, I completely like, forgot that you guys are still Tritons. Fuck you guys. Yeah, we're still Tritons. Except Zola. Zola's the yeah, only one to uh, And who's our forgotten... And who, oh yeah, we still have the forgotten party member that is Zola. Yeah, so Ray's <laughs> going Ray's after gonna him. He's gonna go retrieve Zola. Yeah, yeah, well, get, no, no, no. Get Hang on. Get so, I, I have a reason for Zola to get back. Kind of. Well, Rain's still gonna try and go find out. Number one, he's going to try and retreat Zola still, and number two, he's gonna try and figure out how to turn himself back into an L. He's gonna go ask the shaman. I mean, Rain is more than welcome to go to the back to the underwater city and look for him. That's what he's gonna do. Hey, Michael, do you, uh, do you see where my headphones are? No. Ah. Uh. But then again, it's not my job to pay. So. Uh, true. <laughs> How about yours? Okay. Not right now. Right. And gonna, Grain's just trying to keep the group together, even though we're always falling apart. Alright. Yeah, with Wander basically completely blaming himself for the hundreds of thousands of lives that were killed here. Definitely didn't help with that. Rain was trying to calm him down. Hey. Yeah. Uh, oh, so quick question, DM. Yep. Once he gets back. Right. Hey. Maybe he is trying to speak. I can't tell. Who? Oh. Yeah, hold on. No, nah, I think he's just making noises. I think he was looking for his headphones or something. Yeah, guys, no, like, yeah I'm uh, here now. I'm borrowing my brothers. So uh, would the okay. crossbow expert feet apply to wielding dual revolvers? Uh. Uh. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, there is a gunslinger. Fo there is a gunslinger feat. No, but Mist already has crossbow. Oh, expert. right. Expert. Then, yeah. Uh, but you can might as well just go for gunslinger if you're planning on doing on getting guns. Probably. They seem to do more damage, and he was I quite would... impressed with the shell thing. Right. The gunslinger feet do that's different from the crossbow expert. Oh, I, I do I have that? I might be able to literally pull it up. <laughs> no, I have sharpshooter. Yep, it's my next feet. <laughs> oh wait, the yeah. Just... Um, yeah. Anyway, so yeah, I don't. Well, you guys have no reason to be talking about feeds at the moment. Yeah, and uh, I was just wondering. Right. Well, I think I would go. I think I would recommend gunsling. Anyways, uh, what is Zola up to? Anyways. Yeah. Well, no, I think Rain. Rain wanted to go get Zola. Yeah, Rain wanted to get Zola. And I think we can end uh, Zola's role playing turn and go to and... Zola. What? What is Zola doing? Uh, not as much after Zola stopped panicking, but uh, right. Zola at some point semi attacked a guard and they just kind of threw him back in the teleportation portal and sent him wherever. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna say for I'm gonna say for convenience sake. Yeah. 
Like, I'm gonna say for convenience sake. Yep. I mean, that's fair, because one way or the other, he was gonna go there. And, uh, he, he decided to go check out the gorge. Because he recognized the town and he remembered where the green dragon skeleton is again. And he, he's deciding to try and make his way down there. <laughs> I think so, you're, so, you're, so you're exploring the gorge. Uh, yeah. how? Hmm? How is he going to cross it safely? Because as soon as he gets to the right I think gate... he's, I think I think he's trying to go down into it. Okay. I mean, I... He technically, Jita and Annabelle are still with him. Yep, and they can provide that way of getting down and out. True. Yeah, he's kind of like, yeah, he, Zola is just his own group. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty much. Flinger is a fighter group. ability. Anyway, so yeah, Zola, you, yeah, make, give me a percep, uh, give me a perception check. Okay, the All moment right. you look down into this gorge, you just see Candyland. What? Uh, like no shit. Like no shit. It would be your version of Candyland. Oh. Okay. Mild, oh. just endless, bountiful mounds of magic mushrooms. Oh. In the I'm entire mad. crater. In, into the entire thing. Gorge. Into the yeah. entire gorge. Wow. It's across the entire... Yeah, the the walls are lined with... Hey, before Sif leaves, does he notice anything? But I don't... But, like, 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 it's about... It's about a good 500... It's like a good... Uh, how many feet deep did I say it was? Like 100? Uh, like, it was pretty deep. I'm gonna say 200. I think it was like, like... Right, right at about, uh, right at about the 50 feet mark, like right about, about, right about at the 50 feet mark from the floor. Uh, it starts. It, it just starts with having the it, the walls just start lining themselves with mushrooms. I thought it was a forest. It's technically what, a forest of fungus. Yeah. Like, like, like trees and shit. No. So. But yeah, the moment you get about fifty feet away from the from the ground in the gorge, it just start, it you just see like just the walls are just lined with magic mushroom, and they are truly magic. Like you you can sense the magic coming from these things. As soon as Zola's nose stops bleeding, because it's like it's like so it's like that anime moment. <laughs> He's like, oh, senpai! I finally found my senpais. Fungus, some fungus senpai. <laughs> Fungal senpai. Yep. <laughs> so I'm gonna go into town real quick and uh, try his best to find a place to get bags of holding. In, he doesn't know what a bag of holding is, so he's just looking for bags in general, but doesn't know how stores work. Uh, so if anything, he's running around the town like, where's that bag store? <laughs> um, like People are just like looking at you like, what? <laughs> where's the store that stores bags? Yeah, no. I feel like a few people would like actually busy you. Oh, it's over there. <laughs> I think I'm pretty sure the point of this crazy man. I feel like there will be a street. I'm sure you can pass. Oi! Oi, mister! You're looking for bags? I got plenty of them. You just see this, you just see a market stall, and it's true, he has a lot of bags of varying shapes and sizes. He has like a briefcase and a corner and a. <laughs> I think he has a hamburger backpack. No, 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 no. Let the DM do his thing. Mm hmm. Zola practically jumps to the stall, slamming his hand down and goes, How many bags can I get? 
Well, um, each bag except the one costs about a single costs about one gold, so a lot potentially. Uh, I do have a one. But I do have. I do have this one of extra special bag that is that is an extra po the pocket dimension. Ooh. He's basically describing a bag of holding. Zola looks at Jita and looks at Annabelle and kind of looks at himself. He turns to man and he goes, "I will take that one." And I will take two more for her, and then, like, however many the dragon can take. About two saddlebags. That. Um, that'll be about five, that'll be about 500 and, that'll be about 508 gold. So then he pulls out his magic debit card and kind of. <laughs> for a minute until he eventually manages to figure out how to get money. He does. He has more money than Sif. Can I? That's bullshit. <laughs> Why don't you rob him? Yeah, I'm pretty sure the guard has more money. <laughs> yeah, I'm I sorry, have more money than you do right now. Yeah. To be fair, at this how point, this has over 5,000 gold. That's true. I have 15,000. Oof. Looks like Rain uh Mist is permanently borrowing some money. <laughs> Mist needs to get a job. You have a job. A job. I think you would have I think you would have more luck borrowing money from Zola. Oh yeah. I mean, is my job in... Zola doesn't understand. Is that my job, diplomancy? You're a diplomat diplomancy? technically speak. You're technically a oh, diplomat. Yeah. I am. Diplomancy. Let me go put that <laughs> shit up with the goddamn the priest. Yeah. Yeah, it's just the ever so powerful man. Yeah, there's a slight sound effect. Whenever you use it, people start to hate you a little. <laughs> I did not hear any of that. Uh, the great and powerful magic of diplomancy. And Michael Ad and Michael chimed in. That, yeah, it's a small side effect, though. Every time you use it, peop uh, people sl start to hate you slightly more and more. <laughs> That's accurate. <laughs> yeah. All right. So, uh, how much? How much gold did all that? All those bags cost? Uh, Five hundred and eight. Five hundred and eight. I'm pretty. I'm really glad I have Hawk now. Yep. He's gonna be the most help. I'm. He's gonna need the help that I need. Mostly because. Like, mostly because how OP of an archer he is. Yeah, and because of the eagle, which should be used to Sif. Oh, yeah, and it's good, and it would make great, and it would make great transport, because I think that thing can hold, like, two. Yeah, and it, okay, it would probably, probably just go here, and also, isn't uh an area of, like, right here? Shoot, yeah. I thought I named my owl, I don't know. home. But yeah, like that. I think a giant eagle would be able to hold like two sized creatures. Should I name my yeah, owl? Sif. All it yeah, needs. So... Yep. Hmm. But that's if you can convince Hawk. I I I have a way to convince. Uh, you have the character, bud. I mean, you're only allowed to talk to Hawk for another few hours at this point. Well, technically... Yeah. Um, actually, Hawk has a spell called... Uh, hmm? uh, doesn't that thing uh, last about 12 days? No, wait, yeah. that's not, not Hawk. It was not Hawk, it was Sith. Yeah, but it took... Yeah, but it took about a week to actually get... But it took about a week to get act to the actual ocean floor. Okay. It, it's so that's about. Time. So you got about like five days. I forgot there was a. Sif knows comprehend languages, so that 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 worked. Right. Yeah. In my owl are Archimedes. Like if you if you're using well if you're using uh if you're flying then the travel from here to there. 
would effectively take like three days. Well, no, there's just portal right here. That too. We could take this portal to, to that portal, and then just fly the rest of the way there. Which would, which normally, if you're walking, takes about two days. Yeah. That plus we can see our old dragon like, friend and see how he's doing. Right. Fly. Oh yeah. And then and then, it, but with flying, it would take about half a day to just to get here. Yeah, that's what we're. Going yeah, on. but we can't fly everyone. No, right. Because yeah. we got eight people. Really like, yeah. yeah, but here's the thing: it's purse. And yeah. Only, and only three people could be in the air at one time, and that's counting rain. Oh yeah. Because mm -hmm. rain can fly on in his on his own at any time he wants. Yeah, plus could I could probably just carry of... one person too. Yeah, he okay. could probably could carry a person. So four people could be in the air. Half the party would still be on the ground. <laughs> yeah, but yeah. here's the thing. Uh, Buy we... yourself some flying mountains. I don't know. So yeah, that's about like I'm half the party. Yeah, so yeah, that's like, like, but yeah, that would be like half yeah. the party, wouldn't it? Yeah, but here's the thing: only Sif's only living like this person, unless so, you like, like do it. So yeah, so like yeah, rain. So like rain, hawk, and Sif could go to the mountain, and then yeah, everyone, and then has... everyone else can travel there. And plus, since and plus, since rain and mist share tel telepathic link, like they can let each other I, know when they're coming. I wasn't counting the NPCs because we also like, have the NPCs. We have Sif's wife. Paladin could come. Right. We also well, have Annabelle well, and the dragon. Well, technically, uh, Vita should be big enough for Zola to ride. Annabelle needs to breathe. Yeah. Annabelle does not. Uh, Annabelle does not need to breathe. Put her in a bag of holding. Why would you put her in a bag of holding? Wouldn't that kill her? No, yeah, it would still that. kill her. It would still okay. kill her. Okay. Over this. <laughs> yeah. No, on the but, bag yeah. of holding. But but the thing is, uh, if only we had a portable is, hole instead. Can I do my thing? Holes. Annabelle could make herself smaller because she is a plant. Wait, what? Holy okay. shit. Wait, what? Yeah. Sweet. She is, she is a plant person. I mean, to be fair, when we first met so her, she was only an arm. Advantage of that now. Yeah. She was only an arm. It was literally only an arm when she was born. Wait, it's Hawk's turn now. Yeah, yeah just hold on. Well, but no, yeah, but so, so... I'm just going to say... Thing left to do. So yeah, technically... Technically, uh... Gita should be big enough to hold both uh, Annabelle and Zola. Right, okay. Or one other so, player. Right, so uh, or one other player, yeah. So let let's go so let's go through. So Zola so Zola's good. Rain uh, yeah, Rain Zola's and good. Zola's good, Rain's good. Uh Mist and Rain uh no uh, Rain and Sif and Hawk are good. So, like, the only people that would be traveling on foot, essentially, are Z are Jig, Mist, Ooh. BP, Dan, and Ares. Right. And it's willing to carry someone. And Ares, and Ares can hold three people in that little uh, pouch on his back. Yeah. Probably not Jig Mist, has though. his horse. Okay. Oh, yeah, and Jig, well, has, and Jig does have his... I just realized. And Jig does have his horse. Left who can command, uh, so we got basically air. everyone covered except for the imp like one. Oh, wait, yeah, that's right. Rain yeah, is the one left who can control Ares. Well, hey. rain and miss. What if miss I can't read, hey. miss can't read the instruction book because it's in the wrong language? Hey, oh, right, read all writing. But technically, mist can command him, yeah, right. All right, so let's get to let's get to yeah. Hawk, yeah. 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 Hey, question: What if, what if Sif conjured a minor el elemental? And a minor uh, elemental. An air one. 
Could he just uh, that, uh, they, when did that tear us up? up? Yeah, that uh, would not work. Okay. But well, plus, you get, plus you got a mode of travel. Let me check right. the duration on something. So, while Hawk was on his and way to plus, uh, Jag, and plus was, Ares is pretty flexible was, in his, uh, plus Ares is pretty flexible in his command. So while uh, no. Hawk, mm. Mm. I don't know, okay, I'm sorry, but but Zola does have one thing he has left to do. All right, do it. Please. Mm -hmm. he's, gonna, he, he's taking his bags to the gorge. DM. How, how many pounds of magic mushrooms can he collect? <laughs> Give me an investigation I check. I don't know if that's a pun or not. <laughs> Give me investigation. That's uh, the one question. Oh boy. Yes. Zola, old. Zola manages to get at least 20 pounds of it. Damn, we're gonna start a fucking. Uh, we go do deal. start a mushroom farm? You can start a, a drug. Yeah. Probably. Probably. Oh, you are a fucking mob. <laughs> at this rate, yeah, he kind of is. Hey. It is Sif knows so. in that kind of category. <laughs> there. Anyways, but, time um, to go over there. to Hawk, yeah? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yep, so it's all done. Hawk. But yeah, when it comes to but yeah, when it comes to travel, like yeah. The only ones you gotta worry about are uh, are Mist, uh Jeg, BP, Dan, and uh Ari. Hey, he's got this. Since it but since Jay can summon a horse, and that means Mist, BP, and Dan can uh, can just hitch a ride in the nest thing on uh, Ares' back. Yep. <laughs> Turn now. Yep. And, and since Mist and plus uh, Mist Mist and Rain can tell each other when there's trouble, come to each other's aid. Yep. Right. Because because yeah, Rain because yeah, Rain's all. Uh, and uh, Sif and Hawk can travel in the air ahead. Yeah. All right. So back to going yeah. to Hawk. Mhm. Mm well, Hawk was going to go challenge Jag to a shoot. Sif comes out of nowhere. He's like, "Hey, I need to go somewhere where your home is. You think you can take me there? We'll stop by. after we're done. We can stop by your place, but." Or something along that line. Stop by your place and have a beer real quick. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Once we're done, we can just have an eagle beer. beer. Uh, oh. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Uh, roll for persuasion against yourself. Oh. <laughs> I mean, I am. Is, is, is it really persuasion? Uh, well, does it work? Let's find out. Get the fuck out of here. It works! No! It works! You could do a will save for Hawk. Do a wisdom save, I guess? Yeah, I'll try that. Uh, I think it works. It definitely works. It works! And it works. Okay, yeah, sure, that works. They, they, they can actually talk right now for like two days. No, five days. Five. Because it took a. Yeah, it took a week to get down there, uh, to get down to the Red Ocean floor. And you're already through half a day, so you got like five, so you got like half, you got like five days. Right. We just need to get some supplies, like red rope, real quick. Right. Let's go do that. All right, Dan. All right. Uh, you, you've been ordered by the king to watch these guys. Uh, you've been ordered by the king to watch uh, watch these guys, just to keep an eye on them. Of course, Tyre. Yep, and yeah, now you're just like, yep. Hey, I'm and, with you, guys. Now. Yeah. Uh, Dan's go basically gathered yeah, them up. We've been picking uh, up trays this entire trip. Yeah, uh, Dan's go to gather all of you up, 
And he goes, all right. So apparently the king has assigned me to the lot of you. I and don't really think most of you probably man. don't even know who I am. I I'm, don't care. I, a Sith might have met him before. Maybe. I am Captain You were there. Dan. You were there. I am Captain Like, when he was a kid. Maybe. How uh, old is this guy? 25. My character's 25. Big yeah. role history. Yeah, because he, like, he might have met. He doesn't even bother trying to remember, even if he knows who this is. Mm. Yeah. That's a fifth. Eh. Um, no, you don't know him. I was like, I am Captain okay. Dan Grayson. Oh, Dan Grayson. I know you. You do not know him. Yeah, I know. I'm just playing off like that. Yeah, I totally. You may have heard of him. You may have heard of him, but you do not personally know him. Like, I've heard. You're. You. He, he saved the prince. He saved the he sell he saved the eldest crown princess. The what? He I saved, saved the crown the princess of the human kingdom. Ah, I married yeah. a princess. Yeah, yeah, in the he, necromancer kingdom. No. Yeah, but in the human kingdom, he. But yeah, he saved the human kingdom. Rain, crown princess. Rain does. Rain does. <laughs> right. But yeah. Yeah, um, when he was like, he was when he was nine years old, he actually saved uh, like people. Like, he seven. saved the. Uh, oh, you were seven. Yeah, I was about seven. I mean, about a year younger than the princess. Right, well, right when he was just so yeah, when he was just seven years old, he saved uh, he saved the still the still young at the time, Princess Selenia, who is now crown prince, who is now crown princess. Yeah, Sir Dan, I've heard of your heroic deeds. And I guess I don't. Awesome. And he got trained. Yes. And and he got trained. And he got trained by what is who is now the el the retired head of guard. All right. Like, who the fuck is this? What does he want? Right. Yeah, and he also got, and because of this, he, and because of this, he got, uh, be, he began his training under the now retired head of the guard, who so is you, quite, who is quite an accomplished swordsman. Save your, you, the this, princess. Read it, wait, did he, or was he just, or was he just forced into this position? Uh, that depends on who you ask. He also uh, got, but yeah. I'm asking you, the guy that went through. So yeah, he's he's kind. Of, he's famous for three. He's famous for three things: saving Princess Lenya. That's after that. After that, he began training under the who is now the retired head of the guard, who is who is still quite an accomplished swordsman, pretty much invincible, because no one can beat him. So there's that. I have a feeling if he would try and fight him. No, and the third that. thing, and the third thing he's famous for is entering the torture room and escaping with his life. Is that the one place from the calling god? Yeah, that's a demon god realm. What do you? I have to ask, like his pet. Yeah, does Rain tell he... the party about the? Whole... Yeah, no, Rain. Rain will explain it. Yeah. The, like he, no, does the, does he the, first does suggests Dan, uh, no, Dan, Sith. uh, Sir Dan, I've heard of your heroic deeds, and then when Sif says, "Who the fuck is this guy?" No, no, that's Hawk. Hawk thinks. Or Hawk, whoever said that. Yeah. Also, Rain. You can tell that, like, just by looking at this guy, you can tell that there's something off. Specifically about his right arm and left leg. Uh, left arm and both legs. Oh, left arm and both legs, okay. Okay, I see, I see how it is. The serious question, does Dan know Sith from that? And uh, uh, would I actually know it? Dan, yeah, I would, would know. Uh, 
DM I'm, what Dan no sure Sif. Uh, um roll history. Uh with advantage or disadvantage, because oh. he's probably been in this. Uh, disadvantage. Probably advantage. Right. Because technically he's been here all of his life, but okay. Seventeen. Mm -hmm. Uh, it's a 19. Uh, 17 with disadvantage. Right. Why, why is it disadvantage? I don't know. Because you've been out of the loop for a while. Uh, yeah, you Yeah, you would definitely know the Death, the death Moon name. Ah! Asked. Death Moon. I haven't seen one of you in a while. Uh, is this your wife? Is As he just kind of walks over to your wife. Oh, uh, yeah, this is my wife. It's a She's pleasure a to meet you as he just, like, shakes her hand. Show some respect, boy. She's a princess. <laughs> Be fair, you kind of dragged her around the countryside. Yeah. So you can't exactly expect people to know. Yeah, I know. I just want to see them. Like oh no, Rain, Rain's saying that out loud. He's explaining it. It's like, yeah, I know. I just want him to get flustered. I want to see the reaction. <laughs> uh, you're saying this out loud to me? Yeah. I just wanted him to get flustered. Yeah, I, I just want to see the reaction. Like, these folks in this kind of situation. So they, you know, they get like all casual. And they're like, oh, Right. <laughs> I honestly have no idea what my wife's reaction to any of this is like. Um, all right, so all right. Silver, you saw the stuff, right? Yeah, I, I just read it. Yep. Okay. He goes. Now, what are you? He just starts counting uh, the 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. 13! Are you quite serious? 13 what? He counted the NPCs of the, of uh, the size of the party. Ah, uh, he counted the size of the party, okay. Zola, Jita, and Annabelle aren't there, though. No, he dragged you guys there. He found Who you did? and brought you there. How is he not? So wait, I mean, I is, is he not? So wait, how is he not surprised by the literal plant person and the green fucking dragon? <laughs> See, it's a weird kid as a captain. Of yeah, but uh, you. We, we but I feel like now. even your. I feel like even Dan would surprised by a green dragon. Yeah, I was even not, I was even not surprised. Uh, by he is gonna ask Zola, where did you, how did you get a green dragon exactly? Now you know the curbs are the one in the room. Uh, uh. <laughs> Don't you know, baby? So wait, who's who is he asking about the green dragon? Uh, probably Zola. Dan. He's Zola. He's at, no, Dan, Dan is Dan asking Zola about why you have a green dragon. <laughs> and what's this? Oh, you know, of course, at the bottom of the ravine. Don't you know, Skelly? Yes, I was around there. It said, "Mommy." <laughs> Yeah. Don't think that the people of this city has forgotten of your deeds. Is it iron to Sif? No, he's talking to all of you. Don't think I can't do <laughs> Zola. So far, the only one. So far, the only one that's actually done any like extremely good deeds is Zola. The fuck did Zola do? Kill of yeah, what did Zola do? Yeah, he killed the oh. fire giant. 
other than this man right here, he points over to Zola, the rest of you have either committed some sort of crime or some sort of atrocity. Whoa, whoa, whoa. So randomly poke your brain. finger that's pointing at him. Oh, well, wait, so well, the only ones that would be well, the only ones that would exempt be exempt from this are Rain, Jeg, and BP. Well, there are there are exceptions. Right. Also, did Sif ever tell anybody? He would have. He would have told uh, Bell and anyone else in the party that he's in. Oh, oh, oh! He's going off against me because I'm a necromancer. Yeah. Well, that's racist, I think. Well, he doesn't. Well, he, well, I don't think he quite knows yet that you're a necro. Necromancers are a race. Uh, so what does it come with me? Well, uh, they're kind of a, they're kind of a unique. They, well, ne the necromancers are sort of a unique group of you. Wait, would it take? I, I would would it be because uh, wouldn't it be because of the history check with uh? Dan, that he would know that they're necromancer family. Oh yeah, that too. So wait. Uh, also, you... I imagine the captain of the guard would have heard the whole fucking oh, story of what happened. Yeah. Well, he's not. Well, he's not the captain. He's a captain. He he goes. I'm just a captain, not the captain. Well, well, you well, 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 there, well, there's a name for that for that kind of position. It's called the head. Yeah. That title belongs to the head of the guard. Oh yeah, you would probably. Oh yeah. Um. So here's how. It, here's how it is. Um. There's about. Let's see here. I'm doing some math. And... There's about. There's about twelve sergeants. There, there's about twelve sergeants, eight captains, four lieutenants, and then there's and then there's the head. And she's a pretty good warrior. No, the, no, the head is a no, the head is a man. No, he's talking about the guy's daughter. Ah. Wait, why? What? what? She always wins in our in my spar with her. Then again, she is young and she's still learning. Who is? Uh, the cap, the head of the guard has a daughter that's like, that's like a toddler, and he just lets the kid win whenever she uh, challenges him. Ah. Uh. Hmm. Hawk, I don't. Hawk is like getting half of this. He's like strong woman. Where I got to <laughs> kick her. Out. You're not gonna no. harm a four-year-old. Not on well, my no, watch. Not only and there's like bits and pieces of common. And it was, I mean, if anything, uh, speaking oh, yeah, I would, right now. I should probably tell you the names of. Uh, I should probably tell you the important names, shouldn't I? Uh, uh if you don't mind. Because, yeah, Dan. Yeah. Uh, what? No, I can tell you right now. It's not uh, like just send, them, just send them privately so that I, I could just copy and paste them into uh, to my character sheet. Alright. Alright, but yeah, I'm gonna... Alright, I'll, I'll paste... Yeah, I'll tell... I'll, I'll, I'll tell you names. I'll tell you names, races, and combat specialties. Good. So Dan is introducing himself to our little party here. Right. Uh, pretty much. It's like a um, uh. He goes. Yeah. Now I have the duty to the king. I am. I have a duty to the king, and my king has ordered me to keep an eye on the lot of you. So. I'm only going to ask this question once, and I want it honestly and truthfully. What is your quest? Uh, I don't know with any of your concerns. So, stay out. 
It's none of your business. Well, it is. You're making it my business since I be traveling alongside with you. That's who. The king. Fuck that guy. You do know uh, he could dethrone your notable full titleship, right? And even if you were married to a, the Wait. necromancer across the mountainside, he looks over to your wife. You would be forced out of the, your home country, and to never return. And if he's in a really bad mood, you would be beheaded. If he tries that, it's his head that's gone. Also, are you threatening? Well, I'll have no, I'm not head. threatening can, you. I'm just telling in. you what I know. Wow, so you're telling me that the king's threatening me. Eh, kind of, sort of. I'll just take care of this right now. I don't take kind of threats, sir. Stop attacking things that are stronger than you, please. <laughs> uh, good luck getting uh, past the head of the guard. And Rain's gonna do his best to stop Sith. Please stop. Don't do yeah. this. Yeah, it's like, I don't take kind of this shit. Don't be an idiot. I mean, that's kind of my motto. Always be an idiot. Uh, I think... DM. Oh, wait, is the DM gone? <laughs> so I can just annoy. I'm right here. Oh, hilarious. Yeah, I'm just doing, I'm just doing a thing right, real quick. All right. You're calculating how... No, 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 no. He says, uh, sending me some private information f that my uh, character would know. For, uh... Dan didn't know, specifically. Honestly, I don't really like my hometown that much more. They're kind of... They, they don't like being... Like, they just don't like me. And, and just, uh, Kane, and you're kind of cutting out a little bit. Is it? All right. I don't think Sip likes his hometown in general. Getting like Naruto vibe. Because also, just because you're a noble does not mean you're above the law. Just because exactly. I, I you just please talk some sense into him. A god before. Y yes. Look, He's I literally went to the torture room. I seriously doubt you want to go up against me. Bitch, exactly. You can go down the torch room and walk out fucking non special. No, I didn't just go into the torture room. I killed a shit. very pissed off demon. Okay, and? And got out barely alive. And I was out for a month. So, what I am telling you right now is that you do not want to piss off any of the members of the guard, or, nor the king. I don't mean this as an insult. I mean this as a way of warning you to prevent your death. But if uh, you have that tired. much of a death wish, be my guest. No, 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 no. Don't be his I guest. Just don't that. do it. That dwarf guy. I mean, that quarters guy. He has on my list. So, how many I have, uh, said I would have beef with that I would resolve in the future? I'm keeping track. Oh, Jesus. Don't you worry. I got some, uh, I got some pretty. I doubt I'm actually going to be able to do a few that I've lived my entire life, but I'm going to try. Uh, 
Yeah. Yeah. This, Dan goes, this list Dan is going list. around and in front of you, and he goes, "If you continue on the path you are going now, I will kill you." Uh, now, if I kill you, <sighs> bitch, I'm I'm the mask. You are trying my patience right now. You're trying my. Oh, look, we're even. Jake pulls out his revolver. You're As you can tell, can we're we not destroy. right now. Can we not destroy a city, please? They just fired it into the air. Damn. I have places to be. <laughs> and you are not welcome to come. Well, like it or not, Fancy Pants, I have been assigned to you. Like it or not, it's a personal matter. And I. Are there any more people in than I have? Look, if you really want to. Help your half friend friend. I'll help best as I can. I've seen many oh, people yeah. come in and out of the dungeon. But him? I know what you're trying to do. You're trying to prove to him that he's better. Yes? Maybe. Now, I'm trying to help you to achieve that. I don't need your help. Well, like it or not, you're getting it. Like it or not, I will drop you eight from 80 feet in the air. Noted. Or make that 500. Let's see how far I can make my dimensional door. <laughs> Try it. 500 feet. Exactly. Uh, as long so as we don't run into yeah. Keslo, we should be fine. Um, it's Castro. Uh, sorry, Castro. Is that it? Who is that? My rival. Okay, and why? A long story. I mean, why would we run into him? If we run into him, I'm not here. So tell him you're here. Got it. Uh, <laughs> Jake is going to walk up to Sif and smack him in the back of the head. Can I just grab his hand and... uh? really are a moron. Yeah, I, yeah, apparently, I'm just... What? I got a 30. Ziv is clearly doesn't really like it. God, he's like I'm putting up, not because we're friends. I don't, sure, think, okay. I don't really think any of you really know what I'm trying to do. What the goal was. Hang on, a how does weakness to how does weakness damage type work? Man. Do, do you know of us now? <laughs> uh, the DM is still texting, uh, typing I stuff really to me. hear you. That weakness works. I think it means 
Did you ask? Resistance mean takes means you take half. Damage. And it you don't get damaged at all. Right. The thing is, I didn't hear your question. Occurs, so he's weak to light. Yeah. Doubled. And a shocking grasp on him. He's like, hey, don't can we touch. not fight each other? Yeah. As more of like a warning of don't touch me. Goes, yes, I prefer no. we don't no. cause citywide damage and whatnot. As he looks at you, Sif, and Rain. Right. He's back. Only one of us could do that. You still took right. three damage. No, five damage. 19 plus still 19 took is 18. 9 plus 9, bud. It's 18, so he took 5 damage. I healed him 13. Oh, okay, yeah. Mm -hmm. Alright, so... Also do... He's only taken 2 damage. Okay. So, Sif is just gonna grab Hulk, and that's probably gonna be on the Eagle first. He goes. And go. Uh, Dan goes. All right, let's head over to the teleporter. The blind. That's if you can keep up. On. Oh, no. says, I, I believe it's is best that we stick together for now. I really don't want to. I really just want to help Wander and be done with this. I wish to help Wander too. And I don't really trust you. I have trust issues. You may trust me, for I see nothing. I'm a blind man, after all. You just called yourself a blind man. I am blind. Well, not uh, in it. He's blind. Damn. Uh, the Dan goes. He's blind. You have a blind man with you. Apparently. Must be have a really good he, sense he, of hearing. He just, he, he just kind of came with us. I don't really know why. Yes, how curious. I don't know why half of these guys came with us. Curious. If I'm being honest. I, I, I understand Wander, but the rest of these guys are they're here. Yeah, Wander was kind of the only one keeping the group together. Yeah, now that he's gone, we're kind of just split. And now we just have the cap. Now we just have a captain of the guard yeah, stumbling in here all of a sudden. Wander yeah. was able to intimidate the group together, but Rain is just trying to convince the group to stay together, but it's not working because you all ignore him. Yeah. We're, we're, Listen like, to well, the elf for once, you. Yeah. yeah sorry about. All right, sorry about that. Um, Silver, that should be everyone. You should need to make note of. All right. All right. So, what has happened while I was ty while I was typing? Well, uh, the parties. Yeah. <laughs> it's up for part. Um, Kay and Kay and Dan are yelling at each other. Yeah. Uh, All right. I'm refusing well, to let him. And Dan. I'm like, yeah. Right. We're butting heads. Like, I don't need your help. Go away. Like Take it up as your king if you got. Like it or not, I'm assigned to you. And I will Black fulfill my duty. I don't give you a fuck. Thank you for helping. I can't handle this. And these besides, people. the king told me to keep an eye on you, not to protect you. I don't give a flying fuck with what the king said. But, as. As the elf knows, I am going to protect you. Hey. I think, I think, I think really the only thing you can really problem. do it. I think the only thing, I think the most you can do is help them in the fight. Here goes. All right. 
But that's best oh, hurt. If you want, really yourself, want to help your friend, let's get a move on. Shh. Let us not tally. I'm the only one that knows where we're going for you to come with us. You're not. Could, could we, we refer to the turn order so we can all react to whatever is going on right now? You're in then. Blind pound this time. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, do you guys want to go kill the dragon? Uh... Well, we still technically have the Book of Light, but Wonder's the only one that knows where the where all the locations are for the possible Book of Light. And Sif's the only one that knows the general location, the one thing that can prove to Wonder that he's Yeah, but... But that doesn't mean anything. You could just, you can't just, you know, kill the fucker. We could, but this is like an important part. This is important. You can't let his only friend just raw in the jail cell. All right. Like, all right. So, does that mean that Sif, so is everyone else? So, is everyone else going to kill the dragon while Sif goes for the sword? Like, Sif and. Hawk. Okay. Pound, uh, the pound that goes, <laughs> allow me to come along with you. Like, you guys yeah. can hold off on the dragon. And we'll go too. <laughs> Damn it. Stop splitting the party. It's making it hard. Yeah. I'm yeah. Not, um, I'm so. I'm no, no. Sif and Hawk are definitely the worst. Yeah, I'm leaving Dan. I'm not giving okay, him. Okay, so, so who is going to get? All right, so who is going to kill the dragon, and who is going to get the? Quick question: Does anybody actually know? Okay, I understand Wander and Sith doing, but I don't understand why everyone else just tagged along. Okay, so Blind Paladin's going along with you. Uh, like, I mean, why did they join the party? Um, I don't Rain kind of got dragged into the party during the undead scourge thing. Yeah, but like, why didn't he leave? To help out? And Mist decided to stay in order to steal the awesome sword that he discovered, but that kind of went south. But now he but then he's got gun. Out about about guns, so he's trying to train that. Right, because so, you guys are doing going around doing good for the most part. Yeah, yeah right. so like, the blind power. Uh, well, right, you guys so don't know the reason why I'm he's gonna, around. No. Well, I, well, I think it'd be a good idea to just have. Um, I think it would be a good idea to just have, uh, just to have Sif and BP go in for the sword. Yeah. Because, because Hawks could I'm be crazy. very important in the battle of of ancient black dragon. How about this? You wait. No, it could be just. How about just Rain and Sif? Rain can fly Sif there. How about this day? That'll work, you guys. Just yeah, stay. You just then you watch. I'm like going to be right back. Right. Okay, so Wonder's we're going to kill a dragon. Okay, well, well, how about the party you travels? You know about the dragon? Hold on, just real quick. Well, well, everyone except BP and Dan would know about the dragon because uh, Wander and Sif would have probably told them. I think Wander would have told them. Sif likes to keep secrets. Alright. Yeah, wonders. Well, how, well, how about we get about here? Uh, how about we get about here? And then, like, so, and then Sif can go do his thing. And then once he gets back, then everyone else. Well, I mean, probably gonna go and get Wander. Could, could I say something? Could I say Yeah. All right. Getting the sword I think back. We're all struggling. What was that? I think the we're sword all back. Don't even wander. We'll leave the cell. Wander will what? Won't leave his cell just because the sword is back. He's the one who got rid of it. But it's the sword's only. The sword will prove to him that he. That he, he's at not 
he did not disobey his code or what it already had the sword. Yeah. But then he but he feels like, like he broke and the sword will prove to him that he didn't. At least that's my theory. So do you guys go do you guys go here or not? Uh go yeah. where? Yeah, oh, at least if yeah, what? Yeah, why not? Does I'm not entirely sure what's happening anymore. Who's we We're going to Wonder's old hometown. Uh, it wasn't yeah, nice. I finished what I was gonna say. Uh, go ahead. I think all of our characters are kind of struggling as far as motivation for being here. Yeah, yeah like, nobody has any motivation. I think they're just part of this group as an excuse. Well, I, technically, Dan has a reason to being here with this group. Yeah, Dan is, like, the majority. Stiff and Hawk are just going to go somewhere. Without the plan is they're going to leave. Well, no, not necessarily. They're just going to go to the town, and Sif can go off by himself to get the sword, and then when he gets back, they can they can go kill the black dragon. And I really want to do this black dragon thing. All right. Well, this was the original plan. Sif is going to go with Hawk to get the sword. That was the original plan. Yeah, but why would Hawk would go your plan anywhere that you made all sword? by yourself? What? Why would Hawk go anywhere near for that sword? Because he agreed ready. Right. So, I guess we're splitting the party in half? That was the plan. Alright, so... Well, it's not really in half. We're only we're only gonna be missing like two. Yeah. Uh, yeah. How the goes? Going to how about the rest back. of us take care of the dragon? All right. That sounds like the best idea. Uh, or, there goes or, dragon. Or you could just the <laughs> it really isn't. Good. Finally, a the good dragon. Challenge. This is going to turn to the party. What's in it for? Oh, uh, dragon. Well. Typically, a dragon has a, a, a horde that it usually Why keeps. Why do you guys want to kill this dragon? Actually, it does not have a dra a, a dragon usually has a lot of money on it. Does, especially, does this seem like it was a black dragon? And, it's en and essentially, since this is an ancient black dragon, it's going to have a lot of ancient currency that's going to be worth a lot more. Oh. Well, I guess, I guess, I for yeah. what I remember from Wonder... He said it was an ancient black dragon, which means that dragon has been long here for probably thousands of years. So there's no, thousands. actually not. We don't just go in uh, guns. Apparently, drag, apparently, the average dragon lifespan is a little under three thousand. Actually, well, technically, his statement is a little accurate, though. Uh, like uh, this would be about a two thousand year old dragon. Yeah. He goes, but, yeah, like, it's horde. but yeah, his horde would be about, but yeah, his horde would essentially just be a ginormous pile of like ancient coins, like just ancient currency that would be like way, worth way more than what it was back then. Does anyone have a book that they want to get rid of? Why? No. Why? To trick it. You could just buy one at the store. It's also, ancient, it's ancient currency. Also Fair enough. And if, uh, how about, no, and no, a black dragon likes ancient currency. Right. Black dragons like ancient currency, as in currency from dead empires. Yeah. Paladin says. Or, or at least dead, or at least dead civilization. Paladin says. By the way, the majority of us could take care of the dragon. Uh, Jake, I believe your name is. Uh, Zola. Rain, unless you want to go with Sif and Hawk, Miss. Well, it seems like we would be doing more good taking care of the dragon. Myself and Dan. 
And if Ares wants to. Hey, I already called dibs on his soul. Did you call dibs on? I called dibs on the dragon soul. Well, too bad. You're not going to fight the dragon. You're going to get the sword. You're you have to make the, a decision. You're going to get one to sword. Or you could join us to kill a dragon. Uh, you get the sword afterwards. How about you, true? What the. Well, I'm sorry. What was that about wanting to prove to Wander that he was wrong? Yeah. I need the sword to do that, but I can get no. the sword after. You don't need the sword you have the same enchantment on your your sheet thing on your Sorry. weapon i have a side each sheet plus he, his side it does different things uh you see dan just basically says well i'll join up with you shortly i'm i have to get a few things before i leave uh, you see Dan... Zola Kyrie. What? What was that, Silver? Uh, Dan, uh, Dan doesn't leave the party, but he leaves uh, towards a, what looks to be a barracks area. Alright. While he's gone, let's go. Should Come we... On, should we... Uh, the part of then says, we should at least wait... I think he'll end up killing him if he went with. Look, he could be a vital asset to the fight. If he was like... gonna fight, I would kill him in the confusion. Let's go. Yes, you could do that. All right, so I think I think Blind Paladin sees the idea that this guy is a very skilled warrior. Yeah, like, Blind Paladin sees a, this guy's a skilled to warrior. So let's go, so I don't have to. Paladin just grabs your shoulder. He goes, like, we're waiting. Like well, then you're being left behind. Zola walks over to where Sif is. Yeah, last time we kind of fought a dragon, we sort of made a big hole in the ground. No, no, you didn't fight a dragon. That was Wander and me. Zola and was there too. He didn't do anything. It doesn't matter. He still considers himself a part of the group. <laughs> He's like, you don't include your. Also, Wander single-handedly killed that dragon. With yeah, that's yeah. sort of pretty yeah, powerful. Exactly. Dibs. If Wander, if Wander we need to go get. We need to go get the super powerful weapon to kill the super powerful lizard thing. Yes. Basically. Dan comes back. I'm back. Ah, oh, god damn it. Let's move. <sighs> All right. And it's All right, so... I would much prefer Bell over this guy any day. <laughs> okay, so I guess we're going to the teleporter and going towards this town over here, yes? Yes. Yep. All right. Uh, describe the town as we're uh, basically arriving outside of the teleporter. Yep. We You've been here. DM. Yeah. Uh, care to describe the scenery? 
You see him out. You see him. You see him out. And... I'm at the town. Oh, oh, oh wait. Wow. Yeah, you're in the forest, right? You guys just see a. You just see nothing but green and brown. It is literally just a mass of trees, and you can feel, and. And like your the thing you're standing on feels a little unstable, not <laughs> unstable enough to where you're like barely st trying to stand, but you can feel it like and you but you can feel it. These trees are moving. Ah yes, uh, you hear it from Dan. <laughs> hear him sneeze. Yeah, uh, it's been a while since the last time I've been outside the city. I was building up for quite some time, that's for sure. Alright. And Hawk immediately called to signal for, uh, because Hawk. Alright, so. Like what's the plan? We're going to retrieve the half rend sword, didn't kill a dragon. The sword is what made the most important part. May I ask why you want to go after this sword? You know that trench in front of the city that was... Yes, yes, I know about the trench. I know what the sword can do. But I'm asking why you specifically. You know, well, that wander made that trench swing of that sword. That's why. You're getting it for your friend. I can understand yeah. that. You remind me a yeah. lot of my younger brother. How? In what ways? Determined. Always helping out a friend in need. Oh, okay. From the point of stupidity. Well, yes. he, well, here's the thing. My brother got himself killed by a, a very powerful demon. Main reason that I went towards That's the torture not... room in the first place. Yeah, yeah that sounds I'm, just... I went there I'm and proud. killed a demon. That doesn't sound like Sif. He tried to fight a god and should have died. I don't know why the god decided to teleport him. I got, I got, I tried to attack a god, got teleported. Got this. Damn. I'm sorry, you tried to fight a god? Yes, yeah. he did. He's did well. Did you see? I got this tan because of it. Right. You do know you're not supposed to piss off a god, right? Oh, he does not. Yeah. I hope to be alongside them eventually. Let us get to move on. Yes? Yeah. yeah. Hey, how Alongside them, are you kind of religious? Alright, so... I guess we get to the town, question mark? Yeah, Hawk huh? is so really curious, curious about the moving trees. Yeah, the moving trees are interesting. We, we, can, we can investigate these later. Alright, yeah, so you guys make your way towards the town? Yeah, we're yeah. making towards our way to the old uh, Maelstrom's Descent. Mm-hmm. So, I guess uh, I'll move the token. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Alright, right. so we have arrived. So, yeah, it took you about two days. It took you two days to get there. So we have three days for the transformation still? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All uh, right. Ben's gonna ask about Midway. He goes. So, what are y'all's names before we continue on to tomorrow? Oh, also do the roll. Oh, also roll me. I'm on it. Who? Okay. Ten. What 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 do we encounter? Yeah. 
Sam. Hold, hold on. Oh, wow. The DM is doing that. All right. Jay goes um, and responds. Nope. This is that one guy we, we encountered that kind of fused? Oh, yeah. I forgot about that. Yes. Uh, Sir Dan, my name is Rain. It's a pleasure to make your acquaintance. And that is Mist. He's also me. Long story, but uh, we're separated now. He probably... I'm Stop sorry, I'm sorry. I don't mean to be this guy, but were you two doing it? Okay, so you know how <laughs> Maho elves have two personalities, right? Yes. Oh, never mind. I, I got the picture. One body. Now you have the picture? Okay. I, I, I got the picture before you did set the thing. But... Also, I mean, I masturbated before, so... <laughs> No, I was implying that you two were dating and were exes. But that's not what I meant. No, but that's the way I took it. I like to imagine that Mist hides most of the time and only appears when someone's like directly talking to him. So he's just, no one can find, well, maybe someone can find him, but he's trying to be hidden. Blind Pal that says, he's okay, over there. Okay, I got an encounter. Blind Pal that says, he's over there. Alright, exactly. here's an encounter. Alright. Here's an encounter for you guys. This wings at the Blind Paladin, even though he can't see it. No, the Blind Paladin can see where Mist is. Guys? Okay. Guys, roll initiative. Uh-oh. Are you going to are are us a little thing uh, for uh, combat? Combat thing. Roll initiative. Oh, I did also. Was that everyone? Uh, uh let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, someone didn't roll one. Eight. Damn, I got the first and second highest. Ugh. Why Paladin's going last. He is? Yeah, he rolled a nat one. <laughs> he got a, he's a plus five. To... It's really good that Rain's not going first, because he's more of a support. Hawk's going first. This is going yeah, I'm just second. Getting the thing. Yep. And then this guy's second. Uh, the which one is? I can't remember. Rain is the rain's good. Uh, mid. Right. What, what? Rain's the right, good what's... one, Mist is the bad one. Got it. <clears throat> what is the DM? So yeah, hold on. probably DM setting up the map. Right. No, not a map. I'm just getting all the stuff and I'm just getting all the stuff in this place. Alright, I'll be right back. I'm just gonna send them. Wait, 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 is that a... Is that a savage born? Well, a fire sword? <laughs> yeah, that's just the token I used for it. That, that's oh, the, that, that that's just the picture it. I used for it. Okay. That's just the picture I used for it, okay? Alright, I'm not judging, but... Should our, uh, should our characters continue to chat for a minute while the DM setting stuff up? Um, sure, why not? 
Dan yeah. did technically ask all our names and brains. Okay. The only one <laughs> okay, so here's the situation. Oh, never mind. Five co five kobolds, one savage long. Um, five kobolds, three savage long ran, three wolves. Are we getting like a map to do all this on? Uh, no. All right. So all who's right. going first? Um, you know what? Yeah, I'll, I can set a, I can set one up real quick. We. Okay, Rain killed ten savage long runs alone. I think we've got this covered. What language is that? Draconic. Ah, hold on. Let me check. So... You would not know Dr Well, it's one of the languages is that they speak. Oh. Good. I gotta look. I, I gotta look up. I gotta look up tokens real quick. Alright. Well. Uh, take your time. Well, well, Jay, you... What languages do Savage Longrun know? No. Uh, wait, didn't One. they didn't they speak? Uh, what what was the uh, Inferno? Yeah. They speak Inferno. Oh, then Sif can just talk to them. Well, the Savage Dragon born, Savage born, ah, Savage Ran. Literally. Savage. Yeah. Uh, Sif knows Inferno. Yeah, because I remembered that they were speaking Infernal to uh, Miss, who was Rain at the time, technically speaking, when he stole my katana, remember? Ah, uh, yeah. That was a good night. This is reminiscing as he sees the Savage Long Run. I could try to persuade them to just. Ah, uh, you remember the last time we tried to persuade these guys? No. I do. No, I don't. They still try to. They still try to kill us. I don't think they understood us then, though. <laughs> no, I wonder was trans tell saying was asking them to lay down their weapons or die, and they still attacked. Down your weapons or die is a pretty harsh ultimatum. When you try to intimidate him, two, my poison is 11. Uh, well, you don't know the draconic. My intimidation is 8. Well, even oh, then. What? You can intimidate him. It's better than killing him. Rain gives you permission. Yeah. First, I want him. I want to do this peacefully. Try and kill him anyway. I want to do this peacefully and go out and timid. I don't want to actually fight them straight out if I don't have. So that to tell us we were going to still have to fight them. Yeah. Hey, maybe that. Maybe, I want to tame maybe, the wolf. Maybe I, I might accidentally seduce him. Maybe. I can. I don't know. Seduce them. That that's like, the way I said it out loud. It was funny. I mean, I you, got, you could give it a shot, but again, we're just letting the DM set up the map and everything. Yeah, I, I don't know. Well, it's I, not gonna it, be like a screw and blue map. It's just gonna, it's just gonna give provide an image. Yeah. yeah. It just gives us positioning. Yeah, so it's yeah, you're gonna be running into. Targets. Yeah, you're running into a small war band, by the way. Oh goody. I mean. If anyone's wanting to convince these guys, Jake knows for Draconic. Yeah, and I also know him. So does the Blind Paladin. He knows Draconic as well. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hey. I know. I have 11 in Persuasion. I cannot think of any reason for Mist and Rain to have learned any other languages, so I'm just going to stick with they don't know any other. Doesn't one of them know comprehend languages though? Yeah. Uh, I think I think Rain does. 
good technically with his intelligence score, but I'm just saying. Reason uh-huh. to learn him at the time. Uh, Sif also really? knows comprehend language. By the way, I did dramatically increase the number of enemies because someone did point out, someone did have the right idea of pointing out that Mist did solo 20 of these Savage Dragonborn. Oh, I probably should not. Wait, it was like five. It was like 10? Wasn't it? Because I got all the. Right, right, right. Like, yeah, it was like five. The first oh, time he. Oh, boy. We're, we're goners. Thanks, guys. The first time he imagined him, Sif almost died. Like, and that was in the first session of the game. What level were you? The. Like we three were or four. level three, maybe four. We're yeah. levels yeah. eight. Yeah. And an Aries. I learned my lesson. Don't attack. Use your shield. Your. All right. Look in the top. Look in the top. Look in the top right. Uh, there's wolves. Hey, Hawk knows, uh, what, what's oh, the one stuff? Oh, dear lord. <laughs> Lots a lot of enemies. Yup. We're screwed. Met, you met, you provoked the bull, you get horns. What the Where thing is, is that we probably need a party <laughs> from them? Right, okay, I know what... Place your tokens, everyone. Where, where are they? Yay. Top left. Top left? Yep, top left. I don't see them. You mean the... I, they're not in the top left. Top left corner. They're not in the top left. Uh, look not. up top. I, I am looking up top. There. There's just, like, there's, like, a... Get some more wolf. Uh, Same mine neither. Uh, okay, you know, go to your journal and drag out your character onto the board. All right, I'm gonna try dip. Oh, man. I don't know why you're not able to see this. I like, I'm surprised move. you can't see the tokens. I don't need this. God damn it. You might need to join and rejoin because this thing could have froze up. Oh. Maybe. I think I did it. Uh, oh. why are you all the way up there? No, I don't don't run up yet, bud. Remove them. What happened to the turn order? Uh, because our. Hawks were on this sheet. Okay. Uh, it doesn't show up. Oh, by the Before way, they will be going. Oh, by the way, they will be going. Uh, they will all be going after the after uh, the. They will be going after. They will all be going after you. Who? So, uh, no, as soon as blind. Uh, basically, as soon as blind paladin ends his turn, it'll be all their turn. Oh shit. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. Before we actually decide, any, like before combat starts, can I dissuade them not to fight? You, you can try. You can use your turn. It's like no, I'll let him do it real. I'll let him do it real quick. He can try. Okay. Okay. Uh, persuasion. That's a soft. Uh, what do you say? Uh, gentle. We do not need to fight. We Straight up savages. Go on our very and yes. we can forget this ever happened. What do you say? Does that sound like a deal? Kill the cowards! Okay, now you're going to die. 
Fuck you. Dan goes, did you really think that that was going to work? I don't know. I they, they said that, and I just instantly said that. I'm not very good at being yeah. a face. Yeah, I think you just pissed them off some more. Blind Pop says, Look. well, Let's I believe they are. you swarmed up the hornet's nest, as it were. Last time I fought Savage Strat Long Ray, I almost died three times in the same battle. Yes, but now we have a bigger team. And, and higher level. And we're yeah. way higher level, so we got this. Right. So I guess Tuck's turn first. Yep. So Okay, so get on Hawk. I mean, okay. And uh, there you go. Right, I uh, just ask even more like brother. Wait, my favorite enemy was drag. Were like in dragons, right? For Hawk. Uh -huh. For Hawk, his favorite enemies were dra right long run count. No. Uh, no. Considering that they're technically humanoid. Uh, okay. And if Long Ren are similar to Dragonborn, then they're technically barely related to dragons. Yeah. So would that count? They're not related enough they're not they're not related enough to for that to count. Yeah. Let's get right. combat going. Okay, so he's gonna Let's be go. on He's gonna be on high. I mean, the eagle, and, and he's gonna shoot arrows from above. <laughs> Damn. That that one though. And, and I get extra attack. That one is a. <laughs> hey, you gotta do a separate attack. I did. You gotta I do did. Set... Oh, okay. That's okay. Hold on. So are you flying around on your on your brother? Yeah. Okay, hold on, I'm gonna do something. Hmm. Not sure how you go do flying in Girl Twenty. This will be interesting. Yeah, hold on. He's kinda of just spinning above them. Yeah. It makes it harder for me to be attacked. And I have just, you know, perfect aim. Yeah. I, I'm doing I like how with a nat one, I see 19. Yeah. But, all right, so the, all right, so I'm going to delete your character token. And the giant eagle right. token there is going to represent you and your position, your current position, while you fire upon these guys. Uh, that works. So where is he gonna be? Where's your brother go be in the air? Okay. Uh, so I can't move it. Please, so I can't move it. like this guy. Yeah, let's get that guy. Let me get the big guys. It's always the best idea. They got the big um. One. How high in the how uh how high in the air are you thinking? Uh, sixty. You are currently sixty feet in the air, and you are currently in this position. Right. All right. All right. So you hit the one. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So do you do you target separate? Uh, do you target separate enemies with both attacks? Uh, I want to. How wounded is this guy? Can I? They are all. They are all still freshly. Freshly. They out, be out. wounded. No one. 
Okay. Yeah, this is probably the only okay. wounded party right now. Other than that. Okay, if you're focusing on him with both attacks, so that's a 13 plus 17, that's 30. Yeah. Both both of them will hit, would hit. All right, let me check. Yeah. Um, he's hurt, but he's not. But he's not badly hurt. Oh. Oh, okay. We're kind of fucked. Okay. Blue is gonna. All right. Blue is gonna represent hurt. Orange is gonna represent pretty hurt, and then red is gonna represent badly hurt. Okay. Okay, is he blue or... He's blue. Alright, I'm gonna assume, I'm assuming it's Mist's turn. Uh, yeah. I think. I can't do turn order. I'll move... Three feet. Make two, I'll make two attacks. On what? Hand crossbow. Ow. Oh. Where? Move straight up 30 feet. Straight forward. Uh, please move your character. And here. Oh, wait. I have the wrong mode selected. There it is. I would go for the wolves. They have like wolf pack tech to make them really so the cobalt. Yeah, so do cobalt. Uh, oh, yeah. Cause we gotta we gotta kill the shrimps. We can kill a lot of damage. Don't I have so, that? So, so what are you so where so where are you at uh let's do and this kobolds. One attack each. So this wolf. No, no, no. Uh, these two kobolds right here. I believe yeah. is what he said. Okay. That They both hit and they both kill. Yeah, yeah, yeah babe. Yeah, you just, you just see these two kobolds just get... Just bolts in their necks, just like. <laughs> Is that it? Yep. This kill ball is like. You killed Jeffrey! No, you die! Right. Doesn't Sith have like those five bags of 61 skeletons? Eat five bags of whole. Yep. Yep, you still have that. Literally all skeletons. Unless we need them. Uh, save, save, them save them for the dragon. Oh, yeah. Uh, I'm going to release 61 We don't need that many skeletons. We don't need any skeletons. I mean, I. Uh, okay. Uh, so don't take the skeletons. Kill some kobolds or wolves. The you can't. You, final you could act, You could actually reanimate the two kobolds that just died. That I is mean, true. I want to save it for the good for the big guy stuff. You can't. You can save them for the big guy. All right. With the big guys, uh, be. right? Uh, the savage board, savage red, a, a no, B two B. no, the two cobalt. Okay, a BP thing. You could do some damage, big guy. Oh, wait, where, where's Aries? Oh, right, hold on. Isn't he having a torn order, a turn order? In? I'll roll for him. I can't murder. 
Like, yeah, I only got, I only got Aries. All right, so whose turn is it? Right at uh, Sims. Hey, BP, if I get you up, if you, I can get you up to the big guy. Serious. I'm sorry, what? Uh, Sif's talking to Blind Paladin. What? If I get you up to the big guy, just think you could. Could... Technically, Ares' turn, I guess. Yeah, sure. All right, I'm a. Hold on. Think carefully. He's just gonna use his turn to uh. I'm a go He'll hold his action. Paladin and uh, Ares will hold his action until he has an order from Rain. All right, I'm gonna put in. I'm gonna go up to blind. Paladin. Oh, Sif is, and he's gonna use dimension. Okay. Hi. Why are you teleporting me exactly? Uh, are you using a fourth level uh, spell slot? <laughs> right here. Where? Right here. We're, we're both. Because that's how that spell works. Okay. Oh, now we're in the back line. Yeah, we can do it. We can just get it from. They'll never see it coming. Well, considering that we're talking and two of them are looking at us right now, and those wolves look at us. No, no, that's just the picture. Yeah. I know, and the wolves are probably going to be looking at us very quickly. I think we're in trouble. Well, unless we can do some successful stealth rolls. Uh, okay. Sure, I'll roll stealth for a I should probably be good with wolves. My oh, enemy. no! <laughs> I want to from Black Paladin. Okay. I should be good with wolves. I'm named... I should be good with wolves. Just because, just because you named yourself after a wolf does not mean you're good with wolves. I know, I just... I yeah, wish that, that doesn't mean shit. Doesn't now, mean if your name Jack. is Artorius, we could have a reason. I'm making one of these wolves my own, though. I'm, I'll make it an undead to do so, if I have to. Undead were werewolves would be kind of interesting to see. Aren't you just like half wolves in this campaign? In this uh, campaign, uh, DM, werewolf. We will see. Uh, we haven't ran into a werewolf yet, but I'm gonna say it's possible. I just want the regular wolf. I want uh, the pup. I want a pup or I want a doggo. There are no pup. Um. All right, so whose turn is it? Uh, Sips. But I think he just did his uh, turn, didn't he? Yeah. He did. did he did action, action. So unless he wants the, to uh, use... Dan! Yeah. Dan Hibiki, go! Poof. Poof. And I made a little clank from the blind paladin. Then the right. go. As oh. Listen to the Aries. All right. So, good thing I have a lot of attacks. Wait. If does it uh. Does dashing cost my whole action? What? Does dashing cost my whole action? Yes. Okay, then I'll just go away right here. 
You do you do have the thing with the bull I do, don't I? Mm, you you know, do also have you, you do also have that evocation thing. These guys alone. Uh fudge it, I'm gonna use my crossbow attack. Uh does a sixteen hit? Dishmuck. Include this one. There you go. Which one? Dishmuck. That one is hit. All right, Liam, would you care to describe what just happened? He gets a he gets a bolt to the shoulder. And it. It goes. Rain looks over and gives him gives him a thumbs up. I. Uh, you guys <laughs> don't man. see him actually holding a crossbow. Uh, no, wait, not he, missed. He's not. Yeah, I, like you see a bolt come out. Yeah, you see him launch a bolt, but he's not holding a crossbow. Uh, He's not holding the crossbow, so you don't know how he has a bolt, how he's shooting. Alright, as he fires that bolt, he's gonna push the button on his shield, causing it to become a blade, and he's gonna draw it. The, 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 the button, the button, like the, the throwing thing would be in action. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. He's drawing this shield. But you while did your act. But but you did the dash action. Uh, no, I didn't. He didn't oh right, right, dash, yeah, yeah, right, right, right. Bolt. Yeah, the bolt was a bonus action. Okay. Right. So yeah, do yeah do the damage for that. Then the shield throw. Here's the shield. I'm gonna say it would. I'm gonna say it'll ricochet. Uh, roll me a d6. A d6? Yep. Will do. Five. Five. That's how many. That's how, how many it bounced. Boom, 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 boom. So pick uh, pick the ones that would bounce between. Uh, <laughs> pick the ones that would bounce from. Alright. Full cap. Well, he is a captain. He is technically a captain. That's. Let's see, that's only four. Five. That's all that's going to hit. Before it gets a uh, teleport back to me. Okay. They each take they each take eight damage and those kobolds die. All right. You see him just basically toss his sh shield, and he goes catch. This one dragon board actually does as you ask, and he catches it. And it teleports right out of his hands. Yep. <laughs> Good catch! Not great enough. I'm gonna sh uh, Let's see. I think I got one more attack. So on. you used your bonus action and your action. Yeah, I still got one... Two more attacks left. Yep, because he is a fighter. They get a lot of attacks. I'm gonna shoot him with my crossbow. 18? Alright, uh, that's a main. Uh, the cross. This time the crossbow is a main action. Yep. But it will be. It'll count as attack. So which one are you shooting? Uh, I'm shooting this cobalt over here. That hits, and he is super hurt. He is. He has got a bolt in the eye. Goes. Sorry about that. I'm making quips. That's my thing. <laughs> Alright. He 
it goes. Okay, so that's two bolts down that I'm going to have to retrieve. Alright, so I think I can only do one more thing. And I'm going to... I'm going to cast Ray of Frost. That's an at 20. Can't crit with a spell. Ranch, you can. You can't. Uh, DM? Doesn't do crit damage. DM. <laughs> Where's the DM? No idea. You stole uh, so what's going on? Uh oh, Ray of Frost. Yeah, Ray of Frost on this. Okay, guy. first off, that does. First off, spells do not count as attacks. That's a main action and stuff, so you can't do that. Okay, never mind. Scratch that. Yeah. Out. So you can't crit on spells. Yeah. But you can crit on spells. It's just that he couldn't cast the spell in general. Right. Uh, I'm gonna toss my hand axe. Eleven. Yeah, that misses. The cobalt? Yep. And I'll have that weapon bounce. How up. many times did he switch weapons there? Uh, <laughs> only not one. Not really, actually. Yeah, he only swept once, surprisingly. Uh, and that's the end of his turn. Um, if you guys make a perception check, you can see why. I'm sorry, what? Who wants to make a perception check to see why he only was a why he only had to switch weapons once? All right, either either way, he would notice. Uh, what? Who's that for, Mister Rain? I believe that's from Mist. Yeah, that's from Mist. Okay, Mist, you notice that he's not actually, he doesn't actually have a crossbow. He is shooting it out of his left, out of his left arm. He is shooting bolts out of his left arm. Something new to steal. Okay. Don't steal my arm. <laughs> 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 For the love of God, don't okay, steal my arb! Okay, Static limbs are the most fun the thing to steal. Running into battle, wielding an arm as the crossbow. Hell, it's, back, <laughs> it's, a, it's a lot of other cool stuff, too. And by the way, just reminding you, Dan, you do have that thing with evocation. Oh, yes, I do! But I don't have that spell uh, ready since. So oh, yeah, actually, yeah, there... who... Actually, oh yeah, real doom. quick, roll me a d8 because uh, that might we that already, might be. The... We already okay. I'll just roll the just d8. do it real quick. All right. Yeah, I forgot that. Yeah, I forgot to ask you to do it. Seven. Seven. I think that's what I got. It remains. Hit. Yeah, just re-roll it. Because that's what you got last time, but I do not re I do not allow it for it to remain the same that way. So, like, if you get the same roll, just re one. Okay. That's gonna be handy. Ooh. Does the sound yeah, in, yeah in the upcoming fight, but not in this fight. Yeah. So unless we get there, no. unless we get there. Indeed. Yeah, it's gonna be useless. I have no idea who's. Well, it's currently Dan. I believe that's the end of Dan's turn with a hand axe throw. 
Bye, way. Zola. <laughs> and by the way, the teleporting in. By the way, the weapon bond teleport back into your hand thing. Yes. That uh, that costs a bonus action. You already used your bonus action. Oh. It's just it's just gonna have to stay over there for now. All right. So Zola gets to do his thing. I believe so. It's your turn. Zola, it is your turn. What does Zola do? Zola. <laughs> Silver already knows what Zola's about to do. Zola pulls out his pipe, lights it up, and uh, takes a few puffs. <laughs> yep. I forgot well, he did, did that. I didn't. Also, what is this also, for? You can, you guys can attack these guys. I changed my mind on what I'm gonna do. Okay. What are you gonna do? It doesn't. So what does Zola do? Uh, as Zola smokes from his pipe, his posture straightens out. His eyes are not so quite crazy and dilate, dilated. Big, but not as big. <laughs> yeah, he's actually less. He's actually less. <laughs> yeah, the reason why he's so crazy is because of withdrawal. <laughs> That's why he's so crazy. It's because of withdrawal. So he's actually saner when he's high. Yep. So what is Zola doing? It's a chemical dependency. Mm. Yep. Zola takes the smoke from his mouth, blows it up into the air, and it falls down on him. Oh, shit! Rule beast of nature! Beast or tree? Beast or tree? He's going with great tree. You do know you can't move, right? Doesn't say anything about you can't move. But you are a tree. Wait, why is he turning into hell? It doesn't turn you into a tree, it gives you the appearance of a tree. Doesn't say anything oh. about not being able to move. Ah, uh, and it makes no sense if you couldn't move because you gain dexterity advantage. Right. Okay. Well, I mean, I can I can look up the spell again, but it doesn't say anywhere on it that you can't move. Yeah, yeah, don't That's worry. Just, there's do, just deal with it. Those are the things. Just do it. And, uh, since that is a bonus action, he's gonna go ahead and dash action. Right there. And then... Right about there. <laughs> Zooming. Pew! ta -da. And that will end up being the end of Zola's turn. Okay. I think Jig goes after him, doesn't he? Yeah, yep. I think so. I'll fix it. Let me make sure I put this before I forget. All right. Jig is, uh, walk up a little closer. Uh, 
Okay. And he's just gonna go ahead, pull out his revolver, and start taking a few good shots at these guys. Or not at the revolver, his rifle. So. Um, that's an attack action, and the spell cast costs an action. Oh, that was me. I accidentally I clicked it when I was uh, looking at it. That's the fifth oh, okay. wall. Oh, okay, yeah. All right, whatever. Uh, yeah, never mind. I clicked on yeah, it on accident when I was moved. looking at it. Anyway, that hits. That cobalt dead, in, dead ahead of him. Yeah, he did. You just see his head explode. Like, literally, his head is nothing right now. Like, you know what happens when you shoot someone in the head with a shotgun point blank? Yep. Yeah, he that. He did. It looks like that. Gruesome. I don't want to be that guy. Oh. Yeah, I want to play attack. Uh... On the cobalt right next to that one. Which cobalt? This one? This guy. Mm hmm? He's attacking this one. Oh, he gets two attacks? Yeah. That's Jake like... has extra attack. Oh, well, that hits and that. And it does. Okay, how do you kill him? <laughs> he just takes, takes his rifle, fires, and it. Kind of ends up with the same result as the first one, except it, his head not only gets blown apart, but also part of his chest. Okay. Gruesome. His rifle. Look at all. Powerful. Look at all these. Look at all these X's, man. I mean, we, I know, we're we're basically started. knocked out half of their force right now. Alre already. And it's not even the blind paladin's turn. I need to get more air spells. I think it's Ren's turn. Yep. What's Ren going to do? Um, here. I'm going to... Walk up to here. Oop. I'm going to turn to Ares and be like, Ares, clean them up if you will. I'm going to cast... Cast Taste on Ares. Oh! <laughs> Oh, that's going to be pretty good. <laughs> okay. <laughs> So is that a, this is super power? This is super powerful for the for what Aries is. <laughs> yeah. Is is that it? Uh, Mentioned in the past, I took a lot of buff spells. All right. So I think that's the end of Rain's turn. Uh, that's it. So it should be Paladin, yeah. Yep. Mm. All right. Most of the forces are dealt with, but he's gonna come over to Savage Born Wait, here. No. Um, and it says, go. Um, Zola, I know what you're trying to do, and it says 15 feet. Uh, anything, the ground within 15 feet of you is difficult terrain for your enemy. Actually, I only just read that part now. I was setting up the five-foot radius for something else. Oh. <laughs> uh, okay. And somebody kill, like, two guys. Working on it. All right. All right, so the Blind Paladin's going to attack the Savage Wren. Aries should be going right now. 
he held his action for there, that, uh, there right, does that help? There we go. That Aries was supposed Aries went at the same time as Mist, but he didn't have an order, so he held his action. Yeah. Go ahead. Just go ahead, BP. All right. Nineteen. Hit. Wait, which one are you trying to hit? Uh, this one right here. Mm. It is he? Is I'm guessing he's still standing. Yep. Then uh, the second attack. I'm pretty sure you do get. I'm pretty sure you do get two attacks by. Yes, I do. I t this one's on the wolf. Fourteen. Hold on. I need to find a way to cast self spells on other people. Uh, the 14 is a miss. I figured. But yeah, basically he just swings uh, very wide and tries to hit, like, connect to hits, but misses the wolf. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. I thought you were hit attacking the long run again. No, I was hitting uh, that one was the wolf. Oh, then the second attack hits. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Sorry. And kills. How do you kill this wolf? Um, I'm assuming this is wolf just basically tries to jump. He basically cuts it in half. Wait, Jeg can wait. Jeg can cast Guardian of Nature too. No, I clicked the button by accident. <laughs> uh, Alright, so head choppy off me on the wolf? Yeah, head choppy off the wolf. Then head goes, choppy off Yeah, Yep, I chop off the head. And I go, Oh, such a poor fate to such a wondrous animal. So wait, is BP doing quips now too? No, he doesn't like attacking wolves. Ah. I get it, wolves are cool. And I believe that's their turn. Yup. Let Ares do his thing. Just wait. Right. Oh wait, was it, try did it miss again. hold his action and was trying to get his action in? No, he did his thing. He did the crossbows, remember? Oh, right. Never mind. Okay. Yeah, he killed these two guys from earlier. Hey, DM, can I try and intimidate them? Hold on. Let me th let them have their turn first. Uh, these two wolves are going up on Zola. This one, this one, Cobalt's going to go up on Zola. Is, is Ares not going to go first? No, and he's then going. And then there's one. It's the enemy. Then the right second now. Cobalt. Then the second Cobalt's going up on BP. This other Cobalt's going up on BP. Try it. And these two Savage Long Ren are going to run up on Sith. Didn't I say, do pass? 
ask my own stuff. Yeah, but that was only for that was only for like good for like one round, dude. Oh, is it then? Yeah, it's not like you're hiding in a bush. All right, these two. All right, this wolf is going to attack BP. This and this wolf is going to attack uh, Sif. BP, give away your position. Ah, uh, yeah. I rolled it at one. Hold on. So yeah, here comes two. Wait, I thought the kobold was attacking me. Uh... Oh, right. It was just, like, weirdly positioned for some reason. Right. Yeah, I noticed that, too. Right. Yeah, it just kind of threw me off. Anyway, so, yeah, there's two dra there's two Savage Long Rand attacking. So, yeah, they're going to do two Maul attacks on... Wait. So, yeah, there's two Maul Reaction attacks heading towards right. Sith. What? On, on Sith. I have a reaction, right? Um, if you have a reactionary spell, then you can use it. I'm assuming I'm assuming 20 hit. Yeah. It's not a reactionary spell, bud. You can That's an action. action. Oh. Well, why does it say I can use it? I can thing. Get the circle. All that. Oh. That I could. Anyway, take 12 damage. All right. Okay, and there's about... Yeah, and there's a wolf attack for... Ironic. And since he's within an ally, he gets advantage on the attack. <laughs> one and one hit. And make a strength save. Sif. Oh, it's for Sif? Yeah, that's on Sif. Okay. It's this one right behind you. Oh. Take six damage, and you are not... Take six damage and you are not knocked prone. So I'm prone. No, that was a close no, 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 you're, you're not, not knocked prone. That's double negative. No, you're not prone. You you were successful in the save against being uh, made prone. All right. There's a wolf attack. There's a wolf attack heading towards uh, BP. Try it. <laughs> and he's within you. and he's within five feet and he gets advantage on the attack. Yep. Ah, uh, that's gonna hit. Make a strength save. Yep. Hold on. It also takes ten damage. Uh strength save. You make it? Yep. And now there's a uh, now there's two kobolds attacking with advantage. Safe. I don't think that dimension door was such a great idea. Yeah. I, uh, the I twenty-one does hit. Me. Wasted a fourth level spell slot. You're supposed to use that to get people out of the way, not into the danger. Six spellcasters in the bail itself. All right. Not exactly Sif's strong, brightest moment, that's for sure. Definitely not his dumbest, dumbest though. Oh no, not by a long shot. And I'm assuming the mall misses? Uh, the mall does miss, yes. <coughs> we all know what his dumbest moment was. 
Why is it with my 20 intelligence? Maybe because I'm stupid in general. And, uh, yeah, you can yeah you can play a yeah you can have a really smart character but a really stupid pa- player. Yep. Yeah. No matter how smart my character is, if the player is stupid, the character is stupid. There's a. You could have just said no, and I wouldn't have done this. Uh, there's a pack of wolves. Yeah, there's gonna be a small pack of wolves heading towards uh, Mist's way. Who wish one new fireball? Yeah, this cold ball right here is doing pretty dandy. Actually, can Dan quickly intimidate that cold ball for, to make it flee for its life? No, because that's an action. Okay. That's about five wolf attacks. Yep. Um. That's three. Two more. Yeah. Yeah. Just hold on. Do any of those? Do any of those so far? Miss. Um. Let's see. I'm pretty sure the twenty-two and hits. One hit. One hit. The one hits. This has 18 There's a there's a 16 and a there's a 16 and a 22. No, the 22 hits. That's it. Make a strength save. Oh boy. Yeah, make a strength save. Take 10 damage. There's gonna be two more coming. Two. Oh. Two more attacks. Missed. Hit. You may, yeah, you made the strength save. Make another strength save. Bitch. You make it. Take another eight damage. Yeah, like two of them were like biting at his legs to try to like pull him down, but he's like, No, I will stand my ground. This kobold's gonna attack you. Please. Up. Eighteen hits. Uh huh. Take four piercing. See how it is. Oh, hey, shoot guy! Invisibility. So, when is Ares gonna go? Uh, probably as soon as their, the enemy's just done. You're supposed to go at the same time as Rain. That's not Rain's turn, is it? Yes, but Rain's turn was a while ago. That's my point. Uh, he'll be able to go here in a second. Yeah, Dan is gonna get. Yeah, Dan has three Savage Long Run attacks coming his way. Miss. 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 I'm gonna get left. How many guys I mean. Uh, All right, and it's not other, Ares' turn. Other than the five wolves attacking Miss. So what does Ares do? Uh, Wait, Ares was given the order to clean up. Well, well, what does Rain? No, well, what order does Rain give Ares? I told him to take care of the rest, and I cast haste on it. Did decide what attack specifically he's doing. 
Taking care of rest. As he heads towards uh, Mist's uh, side of things. I'll take that. I'll wear it. Up, big guy. Mist side. Uh, Mist side's a thing. Can he make it? That's what I'm checking. He can make it. <laughs> uh, he should be able to. Be. He does have a weapon with reach. It's and I, he also gets another attack. That too. So he's Enormous. about there, I think. His movement speed's forty feet. Thirty. Can make it right there. You sure? I'm sure. I'm looking at a sheet right now. Mm -hmm. Hold on, I'll check as well. He does have his movement speed of 40 feet. Oh, does haste make you faster? I can't remember. I don't think it does. I think you get more no. attacks. Yeah, he de yeah. But she gets like he gets like two attacks, and no. now he's getting three. Yep. But he does get an extra. Oh no, speed is doubled. Oh. Oh, never mind. Move eighty feet. Now. You haste. You just see him just like swipe it back and forth as it just one by one knocks these things. So I'm guessing uh, everything on this side is dead? Yep. Yeah, everything on this side of things is pretty much dead. Did did the flail arm go over mist? No, I think uh, he only yeah. hit wait, did he how many did he hit? Did he, he only hit three, right? The wolf, cobalt, and wolf. Oh, okay. I misjudged the situation. Oh, by the way, they did go flying in a different direction. Yo. I was about to make that joke. Dang it! <laughs> yeah, they went flying that di that direction. They got knocked. Yeah, they got knocked. They, they got hit hard. Aw, oh, man, and I wanted to talk to the cobalt. Dang it! There's still like Wait, there's still like three more. The there's still like three more. It's Did... Hawk's turn now, right? It's Mist's turn. It's turn. Uh. Okay. Oh shit! Yeah. Um. Yeah, Hawk. Yeah, do your thing. I don't know why it's. And I the Ares, that's his turn again. No. no, Ares will not get a second turn. Why? Because. Oh, oh no! D100, bro. Well, at least roll the damage for the first one, because I'm pretty sure that's going to hit. Oh, yeah. Uh, which thing? Okay. Also, okay. do you want also do you want to use sharpshooter to do the minus five to hit, but a plus ten to damage? Yeah. Only do it before you roll your attack. Yeah, I gotta remind you of that. So which so which uh what, who are you aiming for? This guy. Okay.
That'll be 29. Like in his backside, like in his, like through his forehead. Not I, quite that, not not quite that much, but you did get him like right in the back of the neck. Like I said, in the back. Yeah. It would be, it would be in the back of the neck, where the where the hide is the thickest. Yep. Yeah. But it still does quite a bit. That that's a pretty good shot. Right. Is he a uh, orange or orange? Got it. I'm a... Okay. All right, eighteen. Eighteen gets you. Oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Roll Whoa. me a deck save there, bro. Oh. Okay. Hey, you're 60 feet in the air. So that's what, 66? You make it. 16 versus in a 30. He makes it. Three, and I got 16. He makes it. Okay. Look at that. What happened? I almost fall. If you failed, you would have failed. And that's 60 feet in the air. Yeah, but here's the thing. The eagles move 80 feet. Per yeah, hour. but they can't react but they can't react that fast. They're not they're not quicksilver or the flash. Oh, that'd be terrible if those guys could just There's Yeah, never... that would have been that would have been 66 damage, man. And oh, that's here. gonna hurt. It would now it's it missed. Would kill you. Sorry. It would hurt. Yeah, like now hell. it's missed. No, when it may have First, I'm going to ask with my crossbow because fuck them. You're not going to use uh, anything else? Second. I'm not done. That hit. 15. How is it a sneak attack? Invisibility. Because I'm uh, within. Oh, wait. Yeah, I'm Never the mind. room. It might not be. Invisibility. Closer to me. Aren't no. You're about 10 feet away can... from Ares. And plus, you're not a swashbuckler. I thought Ares was closer. Never mind the sneak attack. Plus, you're not a swashbuckler. So, yeah. that's a 10. Yeah, you were swashed. Then I'm going to Buckley. use my bonus action. Plus, it would be disadvantage. Plus, it would be disadvantage because you're within five I'm feet not, of a thing and making. Crossbow. I have crossbow master. I don't have disadvantage. Ah, it's still ten. Which doesn't hit a wolf. Fifteen. Yeah, it's fifteen. It, oh, okay. Never mind. Does it kill? Yeah, it? because it's on the left side. The fifteen is on the left side. Whatever. It is still only yeah. eight damage, though. It is still only eight no. damage. Yeah. Eh, I'll go over here. Oh. They get opportunity, opportunity of attack. Attacks. But I don't. I disengaged with my bonus action. You didn't oh, have yeah. to say that. Yes, I did. I didn't get to use an a action to disengage. Attack the second time because no, I needed to use my no, bonus second action. level. No, rogues at second level get cunning action, which they can disengage, dash, and hide as a bonus action. Oh. Right. Hey, rogues are so OP. I know they are. OP. They don't get extra attack, ever. Oh, is it? Is that it? That's it. That's all I can do. Right. Uh, Sif? Uh, can Sif, like, just, like, kind of spin his, uh, arm around in one target? Nope. Uh, okay. Uh, 22 hit. On which one? 
uh, this one. It does hit. Okay, can you roll a, a, a DC save? A constitution I save? know, I can read. All right. He fails. Yeah. He is poisoned. Yeah, it's 12 plus 12 slashing. Oh, do you, do, I'm pretty sure Grim has a curse of wounding. Oh, wait, is that? Is I that? know. I'm pretty sure that's another D, 1d4 thing. All right. Got it. Pretty sure that ends my turn. Typically, yeah. Unless if you got a bonus action spell. I don't think I... Is... Is Blink a bonus action? Oh, no, it's, it's an, action. an action. I don't think I have one. Let me check. This stuff's a bonus action. All right. All right. I have a question. Use anime. Mm -hmm. All could right, I man. Take, go. Could I fuck one of these savage boar, savage ran on the back of the head since my uh since my hand axe is somewhere over here? No, because it teleports into your hand, not mule your stuff. Okay. And I'm just going to straight up attack these guys with my sword since they're in melee range. And I'm attacking mm -hmm. each one of them, so. Right. Are you so, using your bonus action to attack with your shield as well? So, uh, not yet. Does 20 hit? Hit. Who? Ten. To Who's the one in hit? front. A natural twenty on this guy. Okay, hold on. Red do damage. Fourteen. Rolling 1d100 right now. Eighty-eight. Hold on. Ooh. Okay. 88. Yep. And 26 on this guy, which I'm assuming hits. The, the one you created has his throat cut. He is no longer able to speak. Ooh. I almost felt sorry for him. Almost. All right. And the last one is a 26 on this guy. Hmm? I I attacked him with uh, 26, 11 points of okay. damage. Okay. And I believe that's the end of my turn. 
Unless mm -hmm. I attack with my shield. Do you? Uh, might as well. So, I'm just gonna do... It is a bonus action. Yep, I'm just gonna do... A blade shield. Does the 27 hit the... Bland shield. Yeah. And yes, it hit. I'm gonna hit the guy that can no longer speak. Okay. Eight points of damage. That's a boring shield you get. I misspelled a bladed shield. You missed a you spelled, misspelled a bladed land. That's Lexia. Huh. Well, I'm bad at spelling and grammar in general, so I'll fix it later. Or did he have will? And that's the end of my turn. All right. Zola. Woo. So, Mr. DM. Mm-hmm. Mr. The DM. Hey, okay. No spores. Silver knows wow. this ability quite well. Oh, yes. And my question is, does this only affect one person within range? It will, no, no, no. It, will it affects only... whoever's within range. No, it's a, it's a... No, when it's just the Halo of Sports by itself, it's a one person. Oh, yeah, it is one person. Uh, so choose your target between the Cobalt... Yeah, you're thinking of, yeah, you're tools. thinking of something else, Silver. Am I? I must be. Yeah. Yeah, the level 10 ability. Maybe. Maybe. On who? He, he's gonna go ahead and target the little kobold there. Alright, what's the con save, DC? Uh, 15. 15. Oh. So, what's the damage? Uh, three. Three damage, unfortunately. Hmm? Uh, three points of damage. I mean, it's only... Okay. I'm trying to see if I have a bonus action thing, but I don't. Oh, well. It's pretty bad to hear it, actually. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, that's right. You hit three damage. Just now in the. I did do three damage. Good job, this, Zola. on the other hand, we'll do a little more. But I'm gonna cast it on this wolf here. Doesn't that explode? It does. So, don't you have so how to make the DC save? It, yeah, I did. That. I mean, DM oh! at that point. That's a natural 20! The wolf doesn't get hit. Well, he misses the piercing damage, but he gets hit with the... I don't know. Oh, no, I'm wrong. He gets hit with the... Cold. Something. It missed the piercing, but it, it, it closed. Ignore that second. Ignore that four. So I'm assuming the kobold and uh, wolf miss, uh, did not make it. One here, it's one d ten. They take two d six apparently. Yep, the cold there on the right. Don't you have to make it too? And that's up to the DM. It explodes pretty much right in front of me. Do I need to roll dexterity to yep. see if it hits me too? Yep. Right. 
Yeah, I guess yeah. that's technically friendly fire. Uh -huh. Oh, Cobalt's froze. No, Cobalt. Don't run away. Come back. Cobalt uh, by the way, can you roll the damage real quick? On the ice knife? Mm hmm. Well, the ice knife, A we. It is already it's, there. It's a it's it's sorry, it's now. the... Wait. Yeah, the... The, the 2d6 oh. cold is the area of effect. Cold. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, is that the 6? Yeah, yeah, apparently. Oh, okay. He just rolled really, really low on the cold damage. Mm-hmm. Wolves are hurt. Is that your turn? Um, yeah, I think this counts. Wait, did we skip uh, Sif? That, no, oh, that's wait, also no, a reaction. It didn't really do much. She was attacking the big guy. It's the only reason... Use Reaction on your turn. Hey, never mind. Yeah, you already Until used the reaction. Ah. Yeah, you used your re yeah you so used the reaction on the hail of sport. Jag. Fair enough. Oh, Jag then rain. Hey, you could have sworn you just attacked this guy with the scythe earlier. I could be wrong. Yeah. Yeah, I did. He's poisoned. Yep. So. Jag, oh. Pal, then, then the enemies, I think. You can do one of them ranged smites. You're not wrong there. You have guns. <laughs> yeah, he has an ability that allows him to do a smite spell at range. Yeah. I, I made a character that had that ability. She was a, uh... So what does smite with melee, do? but only smite with her bow. He goes right on ahead, pulls out his revolver, and thunderous smite right on that one. This one, the undamaged one? Yep. Okay. No, no. Alright, roll do the attack and then roll damage if it hits. Oof. Oof. It misses. Darn. <laughs> Alright. Well, thankfully Jig does have extra attack, so without the thunderous smites, he just takes another shot. Oh, okay. That's better. We could have used that on the Thunderous Smite. <laughs> no, you still have it. It's a concentration up to one minute. Oh, oh. yeah. Well, I guess he is. I fired and I missed. <laughs> I fired, fired and I missed again. <laughs> and I do damage. I hit something. I hit something. I hit something. That's what I was aiming for, Real so damage. I guess I missed. 11 plus 9. Plus the D two D six. Uh yeah, roll the two D six real quick. Four plus another four. And a D hundred. Hmm. 
Does 14 make the save? Uh, I forgot what the actual DC is. It should it just be your spell DC? save. Right. My spell save is 14. So it does he does manage to pass the save. I, that had to be 15. It's a 14 save. DM, you're ruling. 44 damage. Jesus. <laughs> you ripped this guy a new one. Mm-hmm. So how bad it hurt is 44 damage. Pretty hurt. But not enough to, but not enough for it to be orange. Damn. These guys got a ton of health. I did make him to be tough for this explicit reason. Alright. Alright, I believe it's the paladin. Mm-hmm. Oren goes before him. Oh, oh yep. right, right, sorry. So, all of a sudden, you just see armor appear on rain. I'm casting that as a fourth level spell. Mm. He just walks right through this combat and right up to here. All right. Don't worry about it. Where? Oh. Right through your combat with those three. Uh, opportunity attack? Opportunity attacks from all three. No, that would only be two of them. All three are within five feet of him. All three can hit him. I guess so. Where he walks. Yeah, he just puts up his, sh uh, yeah. Dan just put up his shield to protect Rain. No, don't. Let it hit. Mm hmm They, they would miss anyway. Bam! Man. Pussies. Fuck them. BP? I literally tried to let them hit me, and they didn't hit me. Yeah. Oh, it's Whatever. my paladin's turn. I got Garula. Wolf is staying behind me. Oh, uh, one hundred. Oh yeah. Isn't that that's one dead? That's and I'm pretty sure you also decapitate him. Yep. I know it's too late to change it, but still, damn! Okay, real quick, are you wielding it in two hands or one hand? Uh, he's currently uh, wielding it in one. Okay. Times two damage. <laughs> yeah, that so one that's dead. That's twenty. Yeah, that's twenty-one times two. Yeah, he's dead. His head is cut off because Borp along. And now I'm taking this schmuck. Twenty-six. I mean, not twenty-six. Thirty-eight. Twenty-eight. Eh. That Talking. hits and that kills. Woohoo! 
What? No, I wasn't hitting Cobalt. I was hitting this guy. Oh, well, you don't kill him then. No, I thought you were I thought you were going towards the Cobalt. I mean, I still can, but yeah, I'll go for the Cobalt. No, too late. I'll go for the Cobalt to the south. It's too late. All right. Uh, let's see. Good thing though, he is very hurt. Uh, bonus action. Since I get my key back, uh, I'm gonna punch this guy right in the face. Uh, okay. the, co the cobalt this time. Yeah. To the south. I know he's dead. How do you kill him? Um, I kind of imagine that he punches his torso. Well, you don't necessarily have to punch him. There is also kicks. Yeah, I basically just kick him in the torso, and you you see scales and bones just basically indent. Uh, and we see it well, basically an X-ray version of both scale and bone just piercing his heart, causing him to collapse to the ground. Just your mic. I just kicked his uh skull. Uh, 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 Hold damage. on. Hold on. There's a thing I need to do. What was that? Keep the cobalt alive. Hold on. Also, kobolds wouldn't know. Also, a kobold wouldn't know a thing. Yeah. Like, if, like if you're if you're if you're looking to intimidate or in, or uh, interrogate, then it's the it's this the long run you want. Right. Get one of the long run. At, all right. So here's what happens. Here's what happens when you kill the. Oh. Hold on. I Yes. Been a bit annoying. Because <laughs> <laughs> you basically described the next ray. Yeah. You hear brutality. Yeah, just out of nowhere, you just hear a really deep voice. Toad. <laughs> is, that, is it bad that I'm tempted to actually make a Mortal Kombat Dungeons and Dragons campaign? That would be amazing. I don't know how to run it. But, we would uh, all be monks. We would all be monks, dude. Yeah. You guys seen the new uh, new monk barbarian uh, subclasses? Oh yeah, I've seen those. I've been wanting to. For, I'm going to probably try to make one later for if one of my characters die. I think or... yeah, I might want to make an astral monk. Yeah. I would make a monk of the way of dragon. <laughs> Fun. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah, but Those I I basically killed that kobold. Yeah, yeah. X-ray style. Yep, yeah. brutality. All right. Uh, why is this kobold still here? Or still up? Well, why isn't it dead? <laughs> the hell it is. Yeah, the X like the X is off screen when I when I do that when it's right there, so I have to drag it over just so I can get to the. Hmm. All right, and I believe that's the end of my turn. Your turn. There's no all of their turn. Mhm. Mm yep. What's left of the wolves? 
Yep, uh, BP Sif group first. Yep. Savage ran. And uh, make a reaction. Here come, here come, uh, here comes the attacks toward. I make a reaction real quick. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, can I make a free action real quick? Yep, go uh, ahead. I'm gonna taunt this dragonborn into attacking me. Uh. Okay. Don't worry about it. Okay. Oh, I really see what you're doing. Reach up, tap him on the shoulder, and be like, come on. What's up? <laughs> Can't touch this. Okay, so the first two are towards Sith. The first two are for uh, towards Sif. The third one is towards. Uh, yeah, the first one. Uh, the third one is towards. Uh... So Sif, real quick, does the eighteen and nineteen hit you? My AC is eighteen. So would the eighteen hit me? Uh, yeah. Yes. Okay. So that's about thirty-one. <laughs> And and rain take fifteen. Fifteen. All right. It takes um uh twenty damage. Well, he is dead. How do you kill him? Wait. Literally, when wait, he wait, punches wait, wait, wait. me, this guy or when he hit hits me? me, he hit me. I taunted him into hitting me. When he hits me, ice just travels from my armor up his maul and just freezes him solid. That hit me for some reason. Ignore the uh, 49. He, yeah, he just falls over and shatters into pieces. Flawless victory. Rain is a pacifist. He doesn't do <laughs> damaging attacks. But if you want to attack him, go ahead. That's evil. Anyway, this kobold's gonna attack. Uh, this kobold's gonna attack Sif. Oh, god damn! What's with all these guys rolling? Take five. This wolf is gonna bite Sif. I believe that misses. 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 Yeah. All right, now for the wolves over on Zola's end. Did that cobalt hit? Uh, the cobalt hit you, Sif. Uh, yeah, I know. I. All right, so take right, two damage so Zola instead. Does, of... So Zola does a nat twenty four and an eighteen hit you. Well, why is it Because they got pack tactics. I used my arcane ward to block oh. some of the damage on you. I'm assuming. I'm assuming the eighteen hits too. Yeah. Make make two strength saves. No. You're already making strength saves. Oh, that's close. Alright. The wolf that critted you. Uh, take twice as tw take twice as much damage from the wolf that critted you, and you are now prone. Ah. Wait, does so, that true mean I just so I have to use seven, an action before I can use my movement? No, you have so to that use would be half seven. your movement to get back up. Mm -hmm. ah. so, that's, so that's 13 times 2, that's 26, plus 7, that's 32. No, 33. All yeah, right. that's 33. I'm in much pain. So yeah, take 33 damage and you are prone. This is 
that? Now for the long run on now for the long run that are on Dan. Yep. Ready. Only one of those hit. Take 13. Yep. Let's see. 95. So... 82. And then these three are going to chase... Uh, and these three wolves are going to chase... Are going to chase mist. And... Attack... Wait. Actually, does he... He only gets one attack of opportunity, doesn't he? Yeah. Unless he has a legendary, a legendary action to do like a legendary. No, he will. He will get at least one. He's gonna get one of them. That's for sure. And I think we all, and I think we all know that he would hit. So. I'm just gonna say this I mean, one's dead. He could roll a natural one. We might as well see if what he rolls. I'm I, I might as well not. Okay. That's dead. So I heard someone wanted to keep one wolf. A yeah, I don't know. Yeah. Uh, someone said that. I'm Check. not sure. Okay, okay. Mist does an 18 and a and an 11 hit you. Only the 18. Make a strength save and take five piercing. No, oh, that's not too bad. Oof. Yeah, you make it. And it's now your guys' turn again. Hawk? Ugh, okay. Hawk. I would recommend helping out Zola over here as he is prone. Another natural one! Roll the 100. <laughs> what the actual heck? I will laugh my ass off if that is he drops. <laughs> you fall. Uh, you fa oh, you no. fall you fall off your brother. You are currently seventy feet up, and you and now roll a deck save, or else you will drop your or else drop your primary weapon. Thirty-one for the save. I still have one. Levitate isn't a reaction. Take seventeen. Oof. Oof. That's gonna hurt. That's actually not bad for him. Yeah, that's yeah, not, not bad. Like, I dude. still have nine. I'm... Yeah, dude. Oh. Hawk has a lot of health, dude. Yeah. So does my character. I have one more attack left. It hasn't been damaged yet. Sweet. So, yeah, yeah, current, so currently, Hawk is right. So Hawk is currently right there. Here. Right. Who? who my name? Zola. Roll damage. And where are you aiming? Who is? Uh, so Do one uh, of the wolves over here. Uh, okay. Attacking this. He is dead. Yep. One down. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We only got nine left, guys. Mm hmm. And it's Ares' turn. Rip. 
Real quick. Aries is going to ask. Permission to sell them. Uh, miss, 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 miss. Right next to him. Yeah, go do it. Oh, crap. Where is he aiming? The largest concentration of enemies. Oh. Oh, oh, <laughs> oh this is gonna hurt. Oofed. I yeah, there's more. Yeah, there's more. Because yeah, over at Dan, there's three. But over here, but over at Sip and BP, there's four. Zola has one. Currently, right next to currently right next to Mist and Aries is two. So, yeah, BP Sif, make deck saves. DC seventeen. Can I? Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Mist doesn't give a shit about collateral salvo all over again. If I but fail my BP, case, can I use? Yes. Real quick, BP don't have evasion. What? Does BP have evasion? Yeah. Uh, no. All right, so it's still half damage for BP. No, he does not and, have. Oh, so yeah, you both take the full damage, which is uh, thirty-eight plus Hold on, let me check real quickly before I start assuming things. Which would be sixty. Uh. Uh, he does not have evasion. Can I, can I use? Uh, take sixty. Yep. <laughs> I'm down to four. Can I use blink? Blind Paladin's down the four. <laughs> I, will, I will allow you to use blink. Oh sweet, I'm not. Oh sweet, I'm not dead. Someone saved. All right, ig ig no, ignore that third one. Oh, never mind. Yeah, there's only two. Cobalt, dead. Yeah, no matter what, this cobalt's dead. Yeah, I mean, even if the cobalt did somehow manage to survive that, unless they're a muck, it is not surviving that. No. No, because he, even if he did make the, even if he did make the save, he would still take half damage. Like I said, unless he was a monk or a rogue, who which has two. If evasion? he took a fourth of the damage, it would have died. It's a kobold. <laughs> no evasion. It means he literally would have. Yeah, it it on harm. You know. Oh, that Wolf is dead. If it, had, if it was a monk, it could have. They could just send it right back to Ari. That is true. He could send it back to Ares. Oh, wait, technically I could do that too. Yeah. You can yeah, reduce like, the damage. But how, by how many can you catch? Uh, probably not that much. Uh, oh yeah, you don't need to use uh, points to catch them. You, you don't need anything to catch catch. Keep points back. <laughs> Okay, so the one is okay. So the one's the dead. So the one's so the one savage long run is dead. Only one. Oof. Leaving this guy the only surviving run. That yeah, is... and this one's extremely hurt. Just you just need to give him a poke. Yeah, I'm gonna use laughter on him. Oh, on? that's an insult. Literally. No, vicious, uh, hideous. Vicious, uh, vicious Mist? laughter. Hideous laughter. Hideous laughter. Uh, that will do. Uh, what do you do? No. Uh. I'll cut one doggo and shoot if you can give me, If you can give me a high enough animal handling check, I might let you take both of them. Alright, I'll try that first. No, I do not. <laughs> I myself. I have that skill trained. Alright. 
Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna say I'm gonna say you can use a D. Um, or just do it again because I do actually want to see the. I do like I do really like the idea of Miss with hunting dogs. All right. I could just bring uh, make undead. Yeah. One. Screw it, Miss. You got two hunting dogs. All right. Yeah. Let's, yeah. Say, let's say the fourteen does it. You got two. You got two hunting dogs. Hey, we're about to feed. Right, so I'm like, yes, at, left. Hey, at, surviving hey, at least, hey, at least they can hunt for them. Yeah. We still need I a need team a name. Left. Yep. I'm going to name them, um, and I'm, I'm going to try to think of names. Yeah, don't, yeah, get Names later. Wanders, wanderers. <laughs> Not wanders. <laughs> Jaeger. It means hunter. Jaeger! It, it's German. Uh, let's see. I think it's this guy German, needs It's German to... for what? Yeah, I'm using hideous laughter to make him prone. What's the German for? It means hunter in German. Uh, hunter. Your... Is uh G is German for hunter. Ah, uh, Jaeger. We're, we're not exactly hunters though. The the wolves are. Yeah, but that's like a minor aspect compared to the rest of the team. The wolves are hunters. You want me to name one of the wolves Jaeger? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The wolves could be called the Jaegers. How about how about the misfits? I mean, we are a literal band of misfits. Oh, this is for the group. Yeah, I wasn't yeah. saying for the wolves. I was saying overall. Uh, oh. Yeah, that makes me right. the misfits or the wild I know cards. Our, I know our <laughs> oh, wild cards. Wild cards is perfect. Yeah, wild cards. We're going with that. I'm thinking either the, yeah, yeah, I'm thinking either the wild cards or the aces. I fall for I wild cards. Not aces. Our slogan is we put the fun in dysfunctional. <laughs> anyway. Okay, uh, we will discuss we will discuss this at, we will discuss this. Alright, so I think this guy needs, I think this guy's prone. Yeah, he just laughed or he's just laughing his ass. Well, no, it well it doesn't do damage. No, it won't do damage. Okay. It just makes a save. What you say, DC? Oh, my my spell is. Oh, you're trying to keep him alive. Yeah. Oh, that's a nineteen. Yeah, he don't pass. Damn. He, he passes. He doesn't. Mine's a nineteen. He does not. Oh, okay. So yeah, he's just, yeah, he's just laughing on the. I don't know why, but I'm now imagining the Joker laugh coming out of this guy. Oh yeah, it makes sense. Dan? I use the Joker venom on him. Ah, uh, Dan. Dan? <laughs> yeah, that's still happening. <laughs> I <forgot about> that. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna attack all three in the same order that I did earlier. Guys, since that worked out so well the last time. And it worked out pretty well this time too. 24 on the first guy, the one towards the north. <laughs> Northwest okay, well. guy. Hold on. Holding on. Holding on. Uh, okay, now do damage. And west.
this guy. The guy from the west side. Hey. Fudge. It's my turn too. Uh, uh, you gonna do the bonus action shield? Yeah, bonus action shield. Uh, the guy to the north. Okay. Give him some love. Ooh! With your bland, with your absolutely bland shield. I'm gonna fix that later. Hey. <laughs> Rain's going. Consecutive <laughs> normal punches. Okay, so Rain's going to walk up to here and then to here. Why not just come right I here? Make opportunity attacks on me. You just have to leave a threatened I... square. You just entered a threatened square. Plus he can't do. Or plus he can't. Through threatened. Plus he can't because he's under the effect of hideous laughter. Not not this guy. These uh, apparently he's saying he wants to be attacked by this one and this one since he walks over them. Left all of their squares, bud. Went through it, so I went in and then out. You only left this guy's square. You only left this guy's square. Technically. Oh, I what? left all, so I went from. Here. Yeah, entering entering the threat range does there. not trigger. Entering the threat range does but not I, trigger opportunity. Yes, I know that, but I also left their threat range. No. No, you didn't. This guy has a five foot radius. Through here, and then I went to here. You oh. went to here. I went to here. here, and then I turned and went here. You okay. never left the guy towards the north. In but the, but square. the other two. But he's other two? The... Yeah, I'll give you. Do you mean I never left his threat range? <laughs> I guess I am still in his range. One of them hits finally. <laughs> Damage. Oh, yep. Mm-hmm. So how much did all right? Well, he, you take thirteen damage. How much does he take? Takes twenty. How damaged is Blind Paladin, by the way? Four hit points. Um, yeah, pretty damn. Okay. But he's he's relatively safe at the moment. Right, yeah. Um, hmm. In that case... I'm going to I'm touch gonna... him and cast, uh... Prefer haste or greater invisibility. What? You prefer haste or greater invisibility. Eh, it doesn't matter to me. Alright, I'll give you haste. Because it's a lower. That's a touch spell. I know I'm right behind him. Oh now. wait, never mind. Oh. Oh, sweet Mary. So A Ares loses haste, but he hasn't been doing. <laughs> Mm. Now I get to do five. No, wait, four. Well, and your AC what? goes up by two. Yay! Which means I will be... Your movie doubles. Zola. Which means I will be... You have 20. advantage on next save. Which means uh, my armor class will go up to 20. Zola. Yeah. I'm ready. Take down the last wolf. Well, the other did these two over by mist. Oh, no, 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 those are my friends. I said other than those two. I'm really concerned with helping people at the moment. 
do you mean last wolf? Those are the only two last, the only two wolves you left. You don't have to very, do very much solo to kill this last. He's going in to reanimate the one in front of him. Okay. <laughs> All right. That's... And I'm guessing he and I'm guessing you end your turn there and just let him do the attack. No, I still got a whole action. Mm. Technically, bonus, bonus action and action. The I'm just debating if I want. Yeah. Zola. Zola takes a nice uh, puff from his pipe. Blows a healing ward paladin's way. So, I guess I heal for eight hit points? Yep. Yep. Twelve! And then use her symbolic entity. <laughs> And you just watch this like pool of black spores like pour out of his mouth. They sort of cling to him. All right. Hey, do you think I can? Is that your turn? Last... Yep, mm. that is my turn. All right, blind paladin. I believe it's rain. Or rain what? Oh, sorry. Um, Isn't it mist? Zola. I said it's, I accidentally um, went for Zola. So it's I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna assume this wolf is dead. Um. Oh. Is this wolf dead? Would, the one on the right would be. I need to attack with the other wolf. Should, will we use the wolf's chart or zombie? Wolf. All right. Yeah, it'll just essentially be a wolf, but with um, undead fortitude and one hit point. Hit point. All right. Huh? Then yeah. React zombie. These guys. Zombie wolf attack the living wolf. All right, gotta give me a sec. I gotta find the thing for wolf. For some reason, I lost. It missed. Oh wait, no, it does still get pack tactics. So, yeah. <laughs> I think you just got found a decent holes for your fungal spores. Holy shit! Wait, I found a few in one day. All right, I think it's the paladin's turn. Since Miss kind of... No. I wanted to... Oh, sorry. Jax, 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 What are you going to do? Darn. Can't run. Quite all the way over. You can move closer and then uh, delay your action until he's right next to you. I'm going to attack this one. This one's prone. He's that would be disadvantage, and no, I think they're wanting to interrogate him. Yeah. Aim for the other. Aim for the other three. I mean, we still got three more left. Mm -hmm. yeah, but right. that one already yeah, failed. I'm yeah, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they're wanting to save this one for interrogation. It so aim. Be. Yeah. So yeah, aim Jerry's for these three. Go ahead. Takes you to come move up here. Mm. Bonus a sec. Healing word on our new friend Dan here. Wait, was that a Zola thing or a or a Jeg uh, thing? I 
forgot to change it again. I'm sorry. I just need to leave it as. Yeah, just leave it as yourself. Oh, done. Yeah, I'm trying to be clever. Jag uses healing word on Dan, heals him for five points. Was he even hurt? <laughs> it was barely even a scratch on the damage that they dealt to me. So you are basically healed up back to full. Oh no. Okay, and I'm assuming you're going to use your revolver. Yep, you're going to take a couple shots. Oh yeah, but oh yeah, I remember. Isn't the flavoring for your uh, healing spells that like? The, Aren't you flavoring your healing spells to where you actually shoot at the person? Oh, yeah. Jig effectively pulled out his revolver, practically shoved it in the side of Dan, and then pulled the trigger. Or at least what it seemed like. Oh, he yeah. It. They're going to have. Yeah, you two are going to have words later. Dan just gives you the uh, death glare. Anyway, no, the 20 hits. Death glare will. 20 hits to the day. Right in the middle. Yeah, suddenly this guy can no longer talk. And, uh, just to, just to add a little flavor here, after Jay. Oh, God. Ooh. Jig effectively What's that shot second him one? in the back. What? His... What's that second one toward? The same guy. Okay. <sighs> Jig fires the healing ward. I know I pronounced word wrong. Into Dan. Then props the revolver on his shoulder, firing the other two shots. So, uh, All right, Dan's Rain. definitely going to have some words with him later. Uh, whose turn is it now? Rain. No, Rain already went. Yeah, so oh. it would be Blind Paladin. All right. So... Okay. <laughs> Run next to Rain, please. Sure. For this square. Because I'll, I'll help you not die real fast. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Blind Paladin's going to attack uh, this guy. Ooh, 30. Ooh, do damage. Let's see, that's, uh, 19? 16. No, the, no, the three, no, the three is from, uh, 1d10. Huh, weird. As in, as if you were wielding it two-handed? Yeah. This time he's now gonna hold it two handed on this next attack. So you're so you're dealing three damage. Yeah, he's gonna hold it two handed from here on. Alright, so you deal three damage with the first attack. And six damage on the second attack. Wait, what? You're, you're wielding it two you're you're wielding it two handed. Oh, okay, so that's the lowered. Okay, gotcha. No, no, I'm pretty sure the. the right, so the... does the, does that mean you're doing it one handed? Yeah, one handed. Scratch that. Alright, that's thirty two. Alright, should that, that should be thirty two? Doesn't this sword have like a one in ten chance of only killing it? So that tells me we should spare. No, that's only one. No, that's only on a crit. Uh, yeah. is this guy dead? No, but it's very close. 
He's very close. All right, then I'm gonna end him with a unarmed strike. Your damage? Eh. That's an unarmed strike. Yeah, I'm half. How do you kill him? Um. um I basically, uh, punch him multiple times. Wait, 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 wait. I, I need to get... Alright, so... I start punching him... Hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. Alright, so... I basically turn him around and I play, shove my hand into his back and I rip out his spine. <laughs> and I just basically toss it to the floor. You just hear the words, brutality. That was not a brutality. That is a fatality. I said, I said fatality. Alright, next. Your turn. There's only it's, one, <laughs> two left. It's their turn. Hey, well, there's three, three, but there's that guy that we're trying to keep alive. But, Dan says, keep the specious one alive. No, Dan said that. I know. When I train, it makes a lot. Here. Okay. Yeah. Right. Anyway, they do a mole attack. They do a mole attack on. Uh, they do a mole attack on Dan. Go ahead. That's gonna hit. And the last one missed. Take 11. Yep. 76. Hawk. Nice. Hawk, do your thing. Okay, it's your turn. Yay! Okay. Uh, um. In the pools. Uh. Okay, do your thing. It's Hawk's turn. Got it. I was about to say, are you gonna, I swear. Are you, gonna, are you gonna do the minus five? I was about to say, I swear, yeah. if you roll another natural one, I am taking your character sheet. Okay, so that's 24, 22. That's 46. That's gonna kill the. That's gonna kill this boy. This guy? I'm oh, assuming yeah. that's the one he's aiming for. Or this guy. Oh, never. Oh, never mind. Is that. Never mind. He's just really hurt. Which one? The one with the blue dog. You might want to update that then. Yep, I'm updating it. Alright.
There we go. It. It is Ares' turn. <laughs> Literally, while playing with his new wolves, he's just gonna fire two shots, like half paying attention. Actually, yeah. Actually, yeah. Let's get the mist so he can pl try out his new wolves. Uh, okay. It's Mist's turn right now. Yep, it's Mist's turn. I'm giving you a chance to test out your wolves. I don't want them to die, though. I, I, they they're, were, they're at max HP. They should be fine. Okay. Plus, you know plus they're both focused on... Man. Plus, they're both focused on Dan. I'll send both wolves in, and I'll fire my uh, crossbow twice. Okay. Who are you hitting? Save this one. I got plans for it. Why not the save. one of... You see this right one here? here? Save, the, save this one. The one I made. Yeah, Dude, this one, one I got plans. Twice. This one I got plans. Is it for interrogation? This no. Uh. This guy's for interrogation. It, that, this guy yeah, I have plans for. 635 from me, and then whatever the wolves do. I think All right. it's, I think well, it's well, I gave you access. Well, hey, I gave you access to the wolf stick. I gave you access to the wolf stat block. I think it's safe to say this guy's oh, name. Yeah, I see the wolf sheet. That I one hits. Don't you might want to move them. I don't think you can, so I'll just do it for it. The second one misses. Wait, don't they technically get advantage since it's near allies and stuff? Yeah, but that fourteen still doesn't hit. Yeah, but this guy's got rolled. Steady strike saving throw. No, he's just dead. Oh, never mind. Yeah, the 9 plus 15 plus 4 was overkill. Oof. 9 plus 15 plus 4 plus 11, actually. Yeah, <laughs> Don't worry about it. We, just went for, we went for a little bit of overkill. Yep. Whose turn is it now? Uh, yeah, this guy. All right, so this guy's just gonna. All right, this guy here is gonna. This guy's gonna run. Yep, he's very wounded and he's gonna run. He's got uh, self preservation. Wait, he left uh, my threatened square. Can I get an opportunity of attack non lethal? Or I could just use hideous laughter on him because it's my turn now. Eh, use. Hold on, hideous it's not even your. <laughs> It wasn't even your turn yeah, yeah. when he decided to leave. Just, uh, can can uh, Dan there. get an opportunity attack? No, because I got plans for him, and you could possibly kill him. Well, I just use. Can I, I was going to do not lethal. I said so. Let the. He has the. He has plans for him to run away. Just let it run away. I don't eh, really care. Right. Okay. He will come back. He will be. He will come up later. All right. Well, I guess I'm just uh, he's the final bad guy. Big bad boss. He's not. Dan just stands above the corpses and he goes... He is not. <sighs> also, oh, you I notice didn't... that... Also, you notice that all of these well, Savage Longren are red Savage Longren, but that one that was that you left speechless is a black one. Keep that in mind. Uh. Right. So, okay, other the than one. the black Got one... It. So, other than the black one getting away... Looks like we did a pretty good job. Right. Well, uh, Rain's immediately going to start tending to the blind paladin who's almost dead. <laughs> <laughs> blind paladin's wide. J Jig's going to help out with the healing. Don't worry. Because, don't worry, because you'll immediately be back to on the road, and yeah, we will be going to where... We will be skipping ahead to where you guys are uh, at the town, and it would have been about a day of, until that. Yeah, by then, so, so save the spells. 
Right, well... I'm just saying that that's what he would do, is start healing. Mm-hmm. Well, Sif is just gonna, uh, like... We're getting a long rest, so they come yeah. back anyway. Well, Sif is gonna just take a seat on this one. And speaking of speaking of which, um, Dan, roll me a d8. All right. Damn, good roll for me. I was trying to interrogate. Ouch. I know, I'm on it. Uh, Zola is gonna go ahead and use uh, animate dead and his reanimation reaction to revive that other wolf and the kobold that was right near him. All right. It's just going to proceed to revive, raise the, just the big guys. Uh, Dan just basically just kind of... Put him in the back. <laughs> that could be useful. Yeah. <laughs> uh, He's Dan. laughing at something else. <laughs> I'm going to name my two wolves uh, Remus and Romulus. Alright. So, can I interrogate the one foundation? All right, so is the Savage Born more or less tied up at this point? I'm sitting on it. Yeah. I'm assuming it's the next day yeah, and I'm he's sorry. awake and everything? Yeah. Uh, okay, well, I... I'm just going to do it right after the... Oh, that would be like... Whatever you do, make it quick. Who? You, Siv. Whatever you're going to do to this savage, Ren, do it quickly. I just do a little interrogation. Now leave me to my work. <laughs> Which means get out. Pretty sure you would have died yesterday. Oh, but, all right. By the way, um, okay, everyone, deafen yourselves, except K. All right. So, how is everyone in today? Even though I don't see anyone. Unfortunately, this part I'm not going to be able to hear or do anything, so I'm just going to talk for a little bit. I hope everyone's enjoying it so far. Hey. 
I think this is going to go on for maybe another hour. So, we should see you. Well, there's something going on. <laughs> I hate the inside. Oh, why, hello there. If you're just joining in, Welcome to Verona. Make what you will. A Dungeons and Dragons game. Good thing I have that unlocked. So, I hope you're doing all right, whoever you are. And goodbye, whoever you are. Yo. Is everybody? Uh, everyone except Fifth. All right. All right, hold that thought. Can So yeah, Kay, as you go as you go to tell them to what just happened, you can't find yourself to be able to you can't like it, you can't seem to find yourself able to speak a word. Or, you can't seem to be able to talk about the uh, about the subject. Like whenever you do, like whenever you do, you accidentally bite your tongue. Uh, Dan's know. gonna look at Sif oh. and he goes. 
So like, like whenever you try to talk about what, so whenever you try try to talk about how um, the information that you gathered from uh, that interrogation, yeah, you just end up biting your tongue and you're unable to. I you know. Oops. I'll write it down. Uh, Dan goes. What's the matter? Cat got your tongue? Every time, and every time you try to write it down, your finger twists. Like it, like you, you just gotta, like you just feel great pain in your finger as if it's been twisted off. Are Zola you, hears. Sif, are you God. all right? No. Someone's no way, and I can't do. Okay. Well, you try you to figure out. You can't even say it. You can't even. Say, you can't even say you've been cursed. Like anything related to that, you cannot talk about. You know, if someone's fucked me, and I can't do anything. What are you saying? You cursed or something? That's all in a matter of perspective. Mm-hmm. Well, maybe when we go back to town, we could have a clergy take a look at you. Yes. Let's do that. Assuming the information doesn't and we leave your mind. Jed kind of pipes up with, you know, uh, I'm a creature here. I, I could always ask Dornimer for help. Well, give it a try. Uh, Jake, was it? It might. Uh, so are you going to try to cure him directly? He will try to pray to Dormer to either to either see what is happening or cure him. Uh, I don't think he right, like me. Do you place your hands on him as you do it? Yep, he puts his hand on his head. Give me a wisdom save. Oh no! Um, lovely. This should go well. It did. Nineteen. If I fail to ever check that is, then we're all gonna die. Uh, oh. Take twenty. Take twenty-three psychic damage, and you are now, and you are now under, and you are now under a similar effect to hideous laughter. Uh, Dan goes. Okay. No. Like you, you just can't. You just cannot stop laughing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you find yourself, and you find yourself not in control of your body. Even you just, you just, you're for like you're just slowly taking your revolver out, and you're slowly, and I'm assuming you're trying to resist. Like you're just slowly, but and struggling, struggling, strugglingly, strugglingly. Like you're struggling to not keep it there, but you're starting to aim at Sif's head. Uh, oh. Dan's ghost at right in front of Jake's uh, gun. He's just gonna grab it. So one of the first places. Now I have a reason to grab it. Yep, there you go. Yeah, you you instantly disarm him. Yeah, Hawk now has a gun. Yay! Yeah. Uh, you not giving that back any. Jig does have his rifle, though. Yeah, and he's starting to slowly reach for the rifle. Uh, Dad's gonna grab his rifle. Oh, and during... And all and during all of this, he's still laughing. Dan's gonna grab his rifle and he's gonna try to slap him out of it. Real quick, real quick, everyone who's not Jeg, give me a perception. Okay. Okay, here is is uh, stiff. 
27. All right, so who got the, so Rue? Which uh, Rue? Oh uh, yeah, Zola. Durr. But yeah, Zola <laughs> and Zola Sif. By Paladin currently is. I'm uh, I'm assuming I'm assuming the 27 is Sif. Yeah. Yes. Okay, Sif, you notice that same. You notice a sickly red in his eyes. Like his eyes are just like a dark, like are just like a sickly dark red. Oh, okay. Zola, you notice the same thing. Uh, does Dan notice? Because he rolled a 22. Yes, you do notice. I'm just gonna medicine bitch slap him. It does not work. He is he is actually he's actually get he's actually getting the rifle and pointing it at you fast. Zola's gonna run up and cast the spell. Out of hands. Hello? What? Lock gets the rifle, sorry. Okay. Press, push the talk. Does, does Zola succeed in turning Jig into a gaseous storm? Uh, yeah. So now Jig is a cloud of smoke. Dan looks over to Zola and goes, Okay, somebody better start explaining what the hell is going on. What in the torture room is going on? I literally you can't. Think I, you think I have any idea what's going on? He's a madman, apparently. I know what's going on, but I literally can't think about it. Uh, Jag, give me a wisdom save. Oh, I can't find wisdom. I'm an idiot. There it is. I just realized Jag, this is a laughing... Right. Jag take an additional 12 psychic damage, and all of a sudden... All of a sudden... uh, Yeah, all of a sudden you're conscious again. You don't know what just happened. Like last time, you, like one minute you were doing a prayer to heal Sif, the next, like the next you have your guns taken away from you and you're in a gaseous form. Uh, Dan says, what I think it's the... uh, safe. I think it's safe to say that he could be back now. Uh, Zola? By the way, his mist was a dark, like a sickly dark red, but now it just went to a pure white. Hmm. Hawk is not giving the guns back. Hawk? And Hawk will scream. Give them back to the nice man. Hawk will get on his brother. Oh, and Jag, one thing you do remember is just a face. Just a pitch black face. Was it Hell, you could barely pitch? you could you could even you could barely even make out his face. Like you can only make out the silhouette of a face, but the, but the eyes they were a dark they were just a dark sickly red. So it's that like, same you can, face you, you can saw a long you can time sense ago. you can sense just the pure rage emanating from it. Zola goes ahead. Turns Jig back into physical state. Right. Dan's just like trying now. to make sure that, that uh, Hawk doesn't steal Jake's guns. He already did. He's not getting. Like, can you really trust? He goes. He seems to be fine now. 
He goes, Jig, what the heck? What in the torture room happened? I ain't 100% sure, but if I remember right, looks like whatever is affecting this fella is what was affecting those people way back in Devil's Tongue. Devil. Or the Devil's Throat, I always forget. I think it's Devil's Throat. <laughs> It might be Devil's Tongue. Only when... It was Devil's Tongue. Oh, yeah, there was Devil's Tongue. And do you mention who was affected? What what kind of people were, were affected? Uh, All the sleeping people. It goes, I know who did that other it goes, Yeah, I've seen those too. A lot of them are Sleep. in the clergies right now. So it says, I know who is the cause of, I just literally can't, see, but I'm like 98. Wait, could your friend, the, the, the half friend, does he know? 98% sure. Pretty sure. He was looking into something like this. To this, to this. Best to get this sword and kill that dragon, and best to get back to him as quickly as possible. I got a bad feeling about this. Yep. Jig is gonna walk up to Hawk, and uh, I will politely ask you to hand over my firearms now. Hawk up to someone that's like 20 feet. Oh, I thought he said that. Oh, he's up there. Yeah. Hmm. The hawk's not giving us back. Here you go. Uh, Dan goes. Also, Jag. <sighs> also, Jag, you feel the presence. You're the only one DM. that feels this presence. DM, I, I, I need your ruling on something. Okay. Does Jag need his revolver to cast spells? Yes. Damn. Uh, as his revolver, as his revolver is hold, holding his, is actually attached to his holy symbol. What about the the okay, just the revolver, the yeah, just the revolver. The the, the revolver has his rosary on it. So what about the, the other thing, rifle? I don't think the rifle does uh, no. anything. He's planning on having that attached to his uh. A symbol of Dornimer. So is the rifle just a regular? So or... yeah, it's a regular rifle, except the revolving, changing. Uh, Does it do more cylinder. than a? Uh, it has a lot of. It has bow. a lot more range and a bit more. More, damage. more range and slightly better range. Uh, okay, he'll, he'll no, drop uh, a lot range. better. No, it's a lot better range and slightly better damage. Yeah, sorry, All I right. messed it up and said. He'll, he'll drop the he's more in, he, he range is his game. Yeah. Yeah, but, but you don't have the bullets. Him. That and, um, and I have, that and the bow has a lot more range. Yeah, but here keep in so, mind so I have he has six uh, bullets. Arcane ammunition. I don't need bullets. I make them from magic. Yeah, but that's only that's only for bolts and arrows. That's for bows and crossbows. It, not it's guns. It's called arcane ammunition. Yeah, but it's a but it's only for bolts and arrows. It says you have the magical ability of ammunition. Uh, when the DM is uh, when the DM's ruling says that it's only for those two, it's only for those two. Bolts and arrows. Those are the only two things that will work. Such as. Uh, arrows for bows, bullets for crossbows. Yeah, it it will not work for bullets. As part of a of an attack with ranged weapon, conjured ammunition is one round. The conjured ammunition is considered magic. Bolts and arrows. Ranged period. D dude, stop <laughs> arguing the DM on this. The keyword is part of a, a an attack of a, a ranged Bolts weapon. Bolts and arrows. And apparently, end of story. All right. 
He has six bullets in the rifle, though. And in the, the yeah. revolver. I mean, I gave him back up. the revolver. And plus, uh, the bow has more range than the uh, than the rifle. Yeah, but like sometimes, yeah, but sometimes, but damage. You do way more damage with the bow. Trust me. Why? Just because you did. Dude, have you seen our fight? Dude, the deck, it, dude, you can't add your dex mod to the damage. That's why. Oh. That's, yeah, better. that's why it's more better for you to have the bow, not the guns. Exactly. Huh. Even if you could summon the ammo, it doesn't work as well. Right. Yeah, that, yeah, not as much range right. and not as much damage. All right. Well, you need to get a better bow then. For damage. <sighs> you gotta. Yeah, there are plus three bows. That I'll There's... give you. All right. So. Uh, where you can't we give him shit. No, you can't I'm, give him no, shit. No, no, I'm not me. saying like that. I'm not saying like, oh, here, have a plus three bow. I'm just saying I'll. I'm saying that. Yeah, that would give him more damage. So, ignore me. Ignore the mad ravings of this humble little streamer. Anyways, and, what are we doing? Well, I say we got to the town now. Paladin's gonna look over to uh, Jake. Uh, Oh wait, technically, uh, the Paladin has interacted with Yawn. Yeah, and so has Wonder and Sith and Bell. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Maybe he's and although Ray BP, although BP has not interacted, uh, he has not interacted him with him. And who said it was Yawn? Yeah, true. Uh, we just know that it's a black figure. With red eyes. That that's racist. <laughs> I wonder so if we'll ever so... Hawk still zooming up above with the rifle or is he gonna give it back? Uh yeah. Yeah, he's gonna keep him give that, that back. Uh the blind pounding goes. Oh, this used to be a nice little town. And now it's empty. Now it's fully just... So, we're here to find a sword. You're here mm -hmm. to camp. And that's where we'll call it. Alright. Yeah, I'm tired. Yeah, same. Uh, Wrong thing. Hey, what's up, guys? This is Dungeon Master. Zola was allowed to keep his three little, like, mushroom minions. Uh, was well, the fifth wall completely deaf in the entire time? Last fireball. This will be for high level characters, Dungeons and Dragons, fifth edition. I have no so idea. This I think he was. The spell user is going to have to be kind of waiting for the party. Uh, possibly skip. baiting. So, should I just call this one Mortal Kombat meets Dungeons and Dragons? Maybe. Uh, I'm at this point. Later. <laughs> Anyways. But yeah. So so we're currently in an abandoned town. Yeah, I mean, we're currently in an abandoned town and that's where we're basically in in it for the night. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Zola's gonna end and up. I'm going and I'm gonna see And I'm also gonna see about reworking the map so that way it has all the other additions. Yep. You mean like the whole burnt up area and giant mountain now? Yeah. Yep. 
You might, you might, you might have to add a a mushroom to this map, like where we currently are. Uh, why? Oh, because Zola has about twenty pounds of mushrooms, three mushroom people, the blessings of Joffrey, and the spell plant growth. Oh uh, no! Oh no! Don't you there? Just destroy what's left of Wonder's home. Zola doesn't know what the hell this place is. I'm pretty sure Sif would be like, eh, this is Wonder's old home and stuff. And also you imply uh, that That Zola would be would entirely care. up to K. True. And you, that also would imply that Zola... And that part that would that also imply... That would, all, that would also imply if Zola cares. That too. Yeah. Anyway. Which actually, Wander is one of the few people Zola actually does like. But does he like Wander more than his mushroom experiments? Probably not. It's a maybe. That's a not. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so... I'm going to send it off. Thank you guys all for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you like this kind of content and want to see more, please do what you guys do. And I'll see y'all mates next time.